so clean. It's so clean. I got down on my hands and knees and watched, washed the floor today. Did you? Really? Why? I just, I took everything out of this room and it says that we're live. Oh, we're live. We're live. What? <laughs> Front row. Hi. Hello, hello. 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 <laughs> we're back, we're back, we're back. I feel- For sure, for sure, for sure. I feel very, very like I have a lot of weight hello, on hello. I feel like I have a lot of weight on We're back, we're back, we're back. I feel so who's the rookie. Is that you or is that No, me? I don't even have my YouTube open. I feel like I have it's a lot of weight me. It was me. <laughs> Hi, everyone. I'm a rookie. I couldn't find the go live button. Kyle, I love how you can set your clock to these girls. Kyle, I'll take that as a compliment. <laughs> hey, we're fashionably late. It is what it is. Right, right. How many minutes? She couldn't find the live button, you guys. <laughs> I couldn't find it. <laughs> it was so weird. I'm telling you, it wasn't there. I had to leave and come back. Right, Dean Oliver? Bolo Buddies. Courtney, it would be all positive if we were talking about you, sweetheart. <laughs> Why? What did she say? She said, I'm glad they weren't talking about me. <laughs> uh -oh. Vince's memory says, put yourselves in the correct order. Dot, <laughs> dot, 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 dot. Oh, okay. <gasps> We're nine minutes late. I know, right? That's bad. That's my fault. I ran and grabbed something to eat. Sorry. That's not the correct order. Oh, okay. Sorry. I have to share something with everybody before we start. Okay. I hope she's okay that I share it. Put me on full screen. <laughs> she doesn't even ask. She's just going to do it. Guess who that is? Connie. I know who it is. Holy cow. Connie, you're beautiful. That's our Connie Johnson. That's folks. our Connie Johnson, you guys. That is our Connie Johnson. Oh my gosh. She has a huge YouTube channel that she used to upload her stuff on. She says she doesn't um, use it anymore. Here she is. Connie. I watched, I, I didn't have time. I watched like two, like, <laughs> she's like, oh, gee whiz. <laughs> I, watched, <laughs> I watched like two, like quick ones. I'm going to go watch some more. Honey, drop your link if you're still using that YouTube channel. Steven, thank you not. for becoming a member. Living on a dime, thank you. 1.4 million views on that video that she sent me. Wow. 1.4 million, you guys. Hey, picky Nikki. Hi, honey. You should have a little join button there, but thank you. Hey, Bolo She was on her phone and couldn't figure it out. Hey, Brad Boy. Hi, Brad. Oh, hi, Mama G. Hi, Mama G. Hi. Mama G, you got to be tired. You've yeah, got to be tired a lot. All day. Nancy, what was going on over there? What the heck was <laughs> going on? I yeah. come in and all of a sudden I see something with her writing something. I can't even say it because Courtney's in the house. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? Oh, I don't know. I went in for a minute to say hello, but that was that. Hi, Mary Ness. She plays Lost Treasures Return. She plays in all different groups. Hi, Janine. Hi, Janine. Kyle Elliott. How are you? Hey, Kyle. You become a member by clicking the join button that's next to the subscribe button and bell. And then it'll walk you through it. Hey, Kyle. Hi, Kyle. <laughs> <laughs> Julie Morris in the house. Hey, Julie. Hello, Julie. 
little Martin's Nest. Hello, hello. Thanks for coming back. Shell UK. Aw, new new profile picture. Aw, huh? that's cute. So pretty. Hi, Iris. Hello, Iris. That's okay. We like your company. It's all good. Yeah. Yes, don't ever feel like you can't just join the chat. We love the chatter. Hi, Junebug. Hi, Junebug. Okay, we're really bothering people by not being in the right order. <laughs> <laughs> Casual flipper. Oh, did you, Nancy? Oh, I got a really, really nice note from Mary Ness, you guys. So she got finally got her package, and she was so happy with everything that she got. So thank you, Mary Ness. I got your message. Thank you, thank you. Hi, Joyce. Kyle, you're just so funny. <laughs> hey, Lindsay, Lindsay. I just like to say we're fashionably late. Hello, Tom Cruise. Woohoo. Connie's like drummer for hire. <laughs> Harry Humstone. How hey, are you? Harry. Hey, Dean Oliver. Hi, I know you. Pay no minds. Pay no attention. He turned it off. I shut them off. It just gets ridiculous after a while. Hey, Jay, I haters are going to hate, right? I leave mine on to see how many people hate me. <laughs> Hi, Kimberly. In order. Okay, we did vintage memories. Put yourself in the correct order. Hi, Kimberly. Hi, Kimberly. Oh, Junebug's making a pot of gumbo. Yum, yum. Yum. Alanis Morissette. She does look a little bit like Alanis Morissette, right? Yeah. Hey, Maury. Maury changed her name. Now she's Maury Jewelry for you to envy. Ah, got it. Hi, Maury. I do have Ryan Taylor's registration whenever you pull up okay, on YouTube. Okay, perfect. Pammy, I got your email. I'll, I'll, in <coughs> excuse me. I'll invoice you for that and send one out for you um, probably Monday. Great to have you here live on a dime. Thank you for becoming. Thank you for becoming a member. We appreciate it. Welcome. Welcome. Mimi resells. Hey, I'm Mimi. Denise. Lost treasure return. So right now I think she's the drummer for, oh, let me think. What's his name? I know uh, his name. Tell us, um, I forgot, I forgot his name. He said it last night in the chat. It's a country singer. Cole, Cole and Swindle. Cole Swindell, right. Cole Swindell. Swindell. And other artists. Hey, 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 Janine. One hey, Apple Janine. Hill, welcome in. Oh, no, it's One Tree Hill. I know, right? One Tree Hill. <laughs> You are, Stephen, really. Wow, Stephen, awesome. Huh. Hey, Carrie. Hey, Joanne Trout. She says, woohoo, I just got my dibble box. I like it. Thank you. Oh, good. Awesome. Everything was in it, right? <laughs> Because I told you this, I was saying this morning, if you're missing an item, don't freak out. Because Chesie helped me and the music was playing really loud. And Okay, Ryan. She's no problem. Confident. Thank you for coming. We'll get you wrenched up. Thank you. She's pretty confident that she got um, all the items in the box. But hey, Dale, if you're missing an item, I'm sorry. Welcome. I'll send it. Nice to see you too. I had my thrifter in the house. How are you, Amy? Hi, Amy. Lil City Thrifter. What's up, Miss Heidi? And Miss Gill. Hello, hello. Whoops. There's my chat. Jumping, jumping, jumping. Denise is in the house. Hi, Denise. Pammy. Pammy, Pammy. Thank you, Pammy. Flipping it good. What's up? Cinnamon Vintage Seller. 
Howdy, howdy, howdy. Oh, one Apple Hill. Yes, it's an awesome dibble box. And I did some inventory. I probably have enough to do if anybody else wants the dibble box from last weekend. I probably have enough to comfortably do three more. <laughs> so, so two, because I just got an order for one. Lisa, hello, hey, Lisa. Lisa. Um, Denise, no, I don't think so. Guys, make sure you're emailing tauctionsforyou at gmail.com and not sending it through YouTube. It goes to a different email address. Now, unless you sent it within the last couple of hours, I didn't get it. Or it went to somewhere that I'm not reading. Maury's like, what dibble box? I'm checking, Denise. I'm checking. Um, so Maury, last so so on Saturday and Sunday mornings, T and I offer um buy it now specials. And last week I did a dibble box and it had on it, it had in it, here's here's the list. Oh, Denise. Yes. It didn't pertain to me. It pertained to, it pertained to Pat D's. Uh, I just folded it over to him. He probably isn't interested to be honest with you. Cause he doesn't want to spend that much money, but I sent it to him anyway. Um, Mom, Mama G I'm going to do my lot. Number one, I'm going to do a uh, dibble dibble box from last weekend to um, one apple hill, one apple hill. Um, anyway. So this is what it consisted of. It consisted of six children's books, a Build-A-Bear, a random plush, one stick of incense, two scarves, two pairs of socks. Mm -hmm. They're nice socks. Um, a Budweiser beer mug, um, six pairs of random glasses, some description, some... Not prescription. It's a reseller box. Two Heineken mugs. How much were we selling that for? Fifty dollars. Wow. Okay. My daughter was like, "What?" Um, ten pieces of jewelry. Uh, six pieces of nail polish. One piece of random clothing, and one bar of very expensive rich people soap. What was the name of that soap? Do you remember? I don't. Um, vintage memories. I sent you an email, Donna, to your Yahoo account. I think was that the right email? It should be um, auctions by Donna at yahoo.com. Um, this is the soap. Um, it's the Bulgari. Oh, Boston. I'm sorry, honey. Oh, that's right. Bulgar. Bulgar. I can never say it. Bulgar. Oh, I love rich people soap, Connie says. <laughs> I call it so, rich people. Sorry. <laughs> one Tree Hill would like a box, please, for $50. So that's what I have for lot one. One Apple Hill. <laughs> one yeah. Apple Hill. Yeah. Apple I'm Hill. If anybody else was interested, Donna, are you still open for more? I think I can do two more. I think I can do two more. And that will be it. Maury would love one. You want one, Maury? Okay. Thank you, Maury. Yeah, it's uh, it's really a great deal. Um, T's Dibble Box from this morning, the one that she presented for her Buy It Now, was a really fantastic deal, too. Just the two T-shirts alone um, would pay for the whole Dibble Box. Everything else would be profit. Yeah. 
Mrs. Anonymous can't wait to get her first double box. Mrs. Anonymous, are you okay? We never heard from you again. And mm -hmm. we didn't see you this morning for coffee, so I hope all is good. Mrs. Anonymous, did you get a tracking number from me? I can take one because I never use soap. Maybe Dale meant I can't take one because I never use soap. <laughs> well, I can leave the soap out because the soap sells for a lot of money. <laughs> oh, she got home late this morning. Oh, gosh. I hope you are right. Oh, I haven't billed you yet. Okay. Bill. Or... So, Mama G, we didn't warn you before we came on, or at least I didn't warn you before I came on. I may, I may go a little crazy tonight. It's Jessica. Okay, I'll send you. A okay, call. let me grab a pen and paper just in case you go too crazy that I can't type as fast as I can write. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> Do you get something really special that you're you're featuring? No, I just want to get some stuff out of here, so I just might go a little crazy. Oh, so nice to talk with you, Jen. And you know what, Jen? I, you know, I promised you guys I was going to do a, a video on the shawls and the um, the knitwear stuff. Instead, I ended up taking everything out of this room, and I literally was down on my hands and knees scrubbing my tile floor, washing it with Clorox cleanup. I have it in my lungs a little bit. I can't stand the bleach smell. It really bothers me, but I love how it cleans. It cleans so well. Yeah. It feels so good to be like organized and clean. Oh my God. There's nothing like feeling organized. Donna, are you considering lot three to be the Dibble box for Mrs. Anonymous? No, I, I have her written down. Okay. Amy, I feel your pain, honey. I'm so sorry. I have teeth being pulled. Ugh. Um, Connie's like, I enjoy tea going crazy. <laughs> Blow them up. Joy says, I like crazy. Crazy's good, says Nancy. My heart is the FNF and drove my heart crazy. Oh, gosh. All right. So, really quick, what my dimple box was today. First of all, this is going to be the last time that I'm going to show this one. The blue plate special, I did get rid of a couple more this morning, but if anybody wants one really quick, I'm going to put myself on big. This is the blue plate special. We didn't do any specials last week, so I think it's actually from the week before. Something's wrong with my screen that I can't move things around. This is, like, ridiculous. All right, here we go. I don't know. I have to fix my settings or something. I don't know. So really quick, if anybody wants um, the prior blue plate special, if you guys – want to see this you get the luxury facial cleansing bar by alexandra demarkoff you get the luxury skin toner how much was this 30 30 this is a lips like her ginger color i believe is on this one yes ginger lipstick this one is a lasting luxury lipstick and conditioner new sealed you get three Tova eye highlights. You get a lip brush, and you get an Irving Rice 10 times mirror and a nice large bottle of Alexandra DeMarkoff essential bath oil. That was 30 bucks for that. If anybody wanted that, this is the last time I'm going to show this particular setup like this. Iris, it's $30 for everything you see on the plate, and I've got one sold. Oops. To Elizabeth? You guys know what I was just selling the mirror for, so you're getting it all. Iris wants one? Okay. Thank you, Iris. I don't see that Iris did. Oh, Iris, you? Elizabeth. I'm sorry. Thank you, Elizabeth. Elizabeth. Do you want me to put that as lot one? Yes, please.
Thank you, honey. And that's the blue plate special. If anybody's re-watching this or watches the other one, I will take orders only if you see this from now going forward. Um, does the plate come with it? No, Nancy, it does not. <laughs> it does not, no. Um, and then this morning special, again, I'm, I'm going to mix this up again after today. So unless you want this particular setup, weeks going forward, it's probably going to be different. But it's kind of a conglomeration of, it's a reseller lot. It's just possibly what you want to dabble in. So you're going to get five kids books. You're going to get five 45s. You're going to get five four-wheel via toy vehicles, cars, trucks, five pieces of that. You will get either combination. I have six different styles of Marvel shirts. You will get two in the lot, two Marvel shirts in the lot. It will just be a mystery on that. You will get three, three different pieces of dance clothes. Again, I'll just be mixed up. They're all new. Could be that. It could be a t-shirt. It could be shorts, branded dance, something like that. Three pieces of dance. You're going to get either a, a Borghese scrub or mask. You'll get five figures. You'll get one balancing cleanser. Two sealed 1989 of the Bowman cards and a hundred random sports cards. And how much was this lot? Forty dollars. Forty dollars. So that is that grouping. And if you guys want to see it again, just go back and watch coffee this morning. It shows you on there exactly what was included. Um, again, with just a little tweak here or there. 10 times mirror is awesome. It is, right? Okay, I have Crystal. Okay, Crystal. I'll take one tea. It was funny. No, the gum isn't good enough, Nancy. No, please, Nancy, do not eat the gum. Please. It's from 1989. All right. Thank you. And that is the coffee special. And Miss Junebug would like one as well. Okay, Junebug. Thank you. So am I going to call that lot number three? Yes, please. And I called that your triple box. Okay. That's okay. <laughs> that sounds bad. I want a blue plate. Okay, Nancy. Blue plate minus the plate. Thank you, casual flipper. Hey, Hi. Leon. Welcome back, Dean. What happened? <laughs> he went to go get a snack. No, I don't oh. no, I have no idea. What? Oh, Donna was on mute. I didn't even. Were you talking? It's nothing important. <laughs> <laughs> just, just Donna chatter. <laughs> you guys didn't miss much. Trust me. <laughs> it's okay. It happens. <laughs> I feel like I'm a mute on my house all the time, too. Well, I we don't want you to feel like that here. <laughs> I know. I talk and no one listens to me. Boston does. Where is Boston? He loves Hey, Craig. He's the only one. Carrie. <laughs> Donna's own. 
<laughs> yeah, I was having a conversation with everyone. <laughs> it's okay. I was just saying hi and stuff. It's no big deal. Thank you, Casual Flipper, for having my back. <laughs> oh, she did the emoji. Yeah, no one else noticed <laughs> that I was talking. Thank, thank, <laughs> thank you. Hi, Craig. It's like one of those days, right? Well, I'm high on I'm high on bleach right now. <laughs> <laughs> Great. If it's not fireball, it's. <laughs> I gotta go take a I gotta go take an aspirin or Tylenol or something. It's like really went to my head. But oh my god, it's so satisfying. So satisfying. Feels so good. Gets messy in this office. I know that feeling. I won't even go there. All right. Do you want to go first, Missy? Are you ready? Donna? What? I I have um, an old friend just texted me. He says, yes, we have Donatella sauce and cutlets going today. <laughs> He's making the sauce. I taught him how to make sauce and cutlets years and years and years ago. It's actually an old boyfriend. <laughs> and he still texts me. Isn't that funny? We're still friends. Uh-oh, the Vikings are home from the beach. Um, let's see if she remembers to unmute. Oh gosh, Craig. Good luck with that. Good luck with that, Craig. Okay. All right. You ready? I guess. <laughs> I guess I am. Hi. <laughs> All right. This is the first item I'm going to show. I have a stack of, there's, I'm going to try to do some smaller lots. I'll do some bigger lots too, but I'm going to try to do some smaller lots. These are um, 25 garbage pail kits. And I'll show you which ones I have. I'll go through them pretty quick. And I'm going to start these off at 20. Oops. Wee Wee Willie. <laughs> That's a cute one. I know some of these are more desirable than others. These um, are definitely old. Let me check the number, the year 1988. They're 1988. You say 20 or 25 for your start? You start them at 20. Okay. Thank you. Let's see what happens. Amazing Mason, Jack Frost, Bazooka Joanne. Casual starts us off at 20. Racy Lacey. Champagne Dwayne. <laughs> Wretched Richard. Richard. Millimeter, scrambled, Angie, Aggie, Aggie, Chow Maynard, Butt Bit Brandon, Artie Party, Head Buster, Fractured Frank, Undersea Lee. You San Terry Rush Hour Rush. Hey Chandra. Oh, hey James. Yeah. Stored scavenger in the house. I did start a new candle. Thank you for noticing. I did. I started it this morning. Um Violet Biola. And Busty Dusty. Oh, my God. Look at that one. Oh, my God. <laughs> look at that one. <laughs> Busty Dusty. Oh, my gosh. It's awful. So weird. 25 yeah, now from Little Martin's Nest. It's, like, suspended, right? 
put the card next to the can don't put the card next to the candle oh i won't okay is there any other interest we're at 25 um so some of them have the comics like in the backs of them 27 from kyle Tehran. And I think some of them have the puzzle piece. Hey, what were the results of the GPK beauty contest? Nobody won. Miss, uh, I don't know. I don't get this humor. 29 from Little Martin's Nest. I don't get this humor. But whoever had these took very, very good care of them. Look at them. They're in excellent, excellent condition. The Vikings are wild. They're slamming doors upstairs. How many in total, Kyle's asking? 25. 25 cards? Yeah, 25. Hey, KJ. Hi, KJ. Look at Little Martin's, or excuse me. Sorry. Little Martin's nest is at 29. Okay. Casual flipper is out. Kyle's in at 31. All right, Susan. Thanks for coming in. Oh, hey, James. Yeah, these are these are really, really in great, great, great condition. Honestly, Kyle's in for thirty-five now. Little Martin Smith is going to be out. Put her eyeball in the frying pan. Hey, Josh, I'm just getting in. Is there a, a atom bomb in there? Probably not, but I missed it. Well, I don't, I don't know. I don't know what an atom bomb is, but this is what's in here. Okay, let's call it. All right, we're going to sell it to Kyle. Nope, Picky Nikki comes in. Are they stickers or just cards? They are. Oh, he's so smart. Look at I didn't even know. Okay, so this one is a sticker. See it? The cutout? I didn't even know that they were stickers. And this one is a sticker. So maybe the ones that have... Oh, no, they're stickers. This one's a sticker. Shows you how much I know, right? Um, I've sold these before, but I've never noticed... And this one's a sticker. Yeah, they're stickers, you guys. They're all stickers. Josh says they're all stickers. Yeah. Oh. Cool. Does that make them cool? <laughs> I don't know. I is guess. That, is it better that they're stickers or is it not better that they're stickers? You be the judge. I you don't know. We have Kyle in at 55 now. <laughs> you tell me if they're if they're if it's good or bad. I don't know. What's more desirable? Look at my hair. Picky Nikki's in for 60. I had it like up in a bun on the top of my head when I was cleaning. 1988. Um, yeah. So let me see if they're all 19. So this one's 1988. And I'll just look at a few and I'll confirm for you guys. 
This one's 1988 tops. And this one is, yeah, it says peel here. Hmm. Smarty pants. See, peel here. This one does not have a date on that side. Oh, it's over here. Sorry. 1988. Printed in the USA. All right, 60 now from Picky Nikki. Kyle's going to be out, and we're going to call it. Thank you, Picky Nikki. This one's really cute. You got to get a Donna loop, you guys. <laughs> T, you need to get a bigger one. You think so? Yeah. Uh -oh. Yeah, I think you have the wrong one. What do you think? I should go for the 10? Look at this, you guys. Look at the throw up. It's all faces throwing up after each other. Donna, what do you think? I should go for the 10? Well, which one did you get? I got the... Oh, no, actually, mine is a 10.5. So I think you need the six. Okay. Picky Nikki is at... Donna needs that extra three cents desperately. I do. <laughs> you have no idea. <laughs> Look at this one. Oh, my oh God. My God. <laughs> it's awful. Dental hygiene. Oh my! I'm gonna take. A, I'm gonna. My my daughter has to have a root canal. <laughs> on oh my god! Don't scare her. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a picture of this and send it to her Tuesday morning and say, "Are you ready?" Oh, don't scare her. <laughs> I am, I'm no. gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it right now before it sells and I forget. All right, seventy now with picky Nikki. <laughs> She's going to be like, what the heck? Really, Mrs. Anonymous? Wow. <laughs> Yesterday? Holy cow. Hello, everyone. Long day at the auctions. Awesome. <laughs> right, Lisa? Don't you think it'll be really funny? <laughs> Her reaction will be priceless. <laughs> All right, who's um? So who got them? Um, Picky Nikki, seventy dollars. Picky Nikki, so lot number three, right, Mama G? Picky yes. Nikki, seventy dollars, twenty-five garbage. Mrs. Anonymous, pay attention. Well, <laughs> kids, lot number three. You want to take a minute and show your morning special again? Mrs. Anonymous is asking. Um, oh, my God. I'm having like a mental block. Oh, this morning I did the clothes. Yes. <coughs> Excuse me. I did... Um, I did 15 to 18 pounds of clothes. A lot of the clothes will probably come out of that last storage unit, not storage unit, estate sale that I bought. So there's a lot of designer stuff. Mm -hmm. And um, 10, was it 10 pieces of jewelry? I wrote it down. Did I, do you remember Mama G what I said? No. Um, who remembers what I said? I think I said 10 pieces. I have it written down. I have to find the slot. I think it was 10 pieces of assorted. Here it is. Uh, 15 pieces. 15 pieces of mixed jewelry. 15 pieces of mixed uh, jewelry and 15 to 18 pounds. Thank you, Lindsay. 15 to 18 pounds of clothes. For, Hi, Myra. Hi, honey. For um, clothing sellers. See, Lindsay remembered. She remembered. I know, Lindsay, you're good. Did you order one, Lindsay? I think she did. What? No. Oh, she ordered something. No, she didn't order one. She just remembers. Oh, okay. So, yeah, that was my um, 
Okay, so that was my lot number, my lot number three. Okay. Correct. Um, so I have something that's kind of special here. Um, let me show it to you. Um, there's going to be one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, there's going to be six of them. They are old magazines from um, 1955, and I'll show them to you. And they're all in plastic, so they've Donna, been. Yeah. I'm sorry, Mrs. Anonymous wants to know how much that dibble box was for. That was fifty dollars for the fifty dollars. Yeah, fifty dollars. Fifty dollars for the dibble boxes. Let me know, you guys. Mama G will help me watch the chat. So these are really, really awesome. And when you consider the age of them, so th thrilling wonder stories, science fiction by top writers, um, and they are marked with the year that they are. So. I don't have to open them or show them to you in any way. So that's one. So I'm going to start this lot off at $30 and you get six of them. And I don't know if there's a market for these, but to me, they look pretty awesome. Bigger and better now. Ooh, bigger and better now. Special issue. Startling stories. The time... An astonishing novel by, let's say, 1949 is this one. 1949. I'd love to open them up and look at them, but I'm not going to. I'm going to leave them sealed. This was 10 cents. Famous okay. Fantastic Mysteries. Lot number D4 is going to go for Donna's, your special from this morning. To whom? To Mrs. Anonymous. To Mrs. Anonymous? Okay. The bow flows what? $50 to Mrs. Anonymous. Okay, thank you so much, Mrs. Anonymous. All right, um, so back to these. This one is 1940, you guys. Look at that. December 1940s. Look at the advertisement in the back. So, I mean, this, this would make for, you know, ephemera is so popular right now. I mean, I hate to even suggest this, but, gosh, you could, like, probably sell these by the page. You know what I mean? Take the pages out and sell them by the page. I mean, the, the whole book might be valuable, but people might buy just the individual pages because it's, they're so unique. And Crystal would like one too. What is going on there? She's all smiles and he's all smiles and this person's laying down. This one's 1948. Okay, I'm gonna write it down in one second. Okay. For graduation and every gift occasion. That's awesome, too. Okay, lot number five is going to who? Crystal Velasquez. Crystal wants the clothing dibble. Yes. Thank you guys so much. I got to get rid of all those clothes, so I really appreciate you buying them. Okay. <clears throat> okay, and here's the next one. A Merits 25 cents fantasy. And the faces of the abyss. I don't know. Oh, and it's BF Goodrich in the back. And I, I imagine the um advertisements and inside of these must be must be amazing and then here's the last one this one's 1946 fall issue wonder stories pocket universe amazing complete novel and here's the back a discharge ring from world war 2 only a dollar 98 
Can I order 10 dozen? <laughs> oh my God. That's awesome. 1946. The high bid on this lot is Josh at 30. All of the other things I've been dropping, Connie and everyone else, has been lots of the reseller clothing lot. So okay. I need 32 as the next bid. Josh is at 30. Okay. This is 227, lot number six. Connie's at 32. Thank you, Connie. They're so unique, right, you guys? I love that ad. That's awesome. That's an awesome ad right there. 1940. Hey, secret agent. Welcome in. Santa Claus rubber mask. Send no money. Jeez. What's that, an honor roll? I mean, an honor system advertisement? They'll send you the mask if you like it, then you pay for it? I mean, I think this was before credit cards, so they can't get your credit card. Today they get your credit card and if you don't return it, right? For real job security, get an ICS diploma. What's ICS? Cost pennies a day. Does anybody know what an ICS diploma is? Did you say Tacoma? International Correspondence Schools. No, an I, I see, ICS diploma. It's a type of school that they used to have, I guess, where you can get diplomas. Oh, thank you, Secret Agent, for the $5 pound. And you can get a diploma in air conditioning and the building contractor, chemistry, electrical, radio, TV, railroad, textile, steam and diesel, power, aviation. Does that school still exist, you guys? Does anybody know about this school? Look at, look at all the stuff you could go to this school for. You could go to be a... Uh, International uh, Correspondence School is what is Pammy it, says. Is it still around? Oh, I don't know. It's in Pennsylvania. Did you see the question that you had from Maury? Oh, you believe it was like a homeschooling? How many total books? I forgot how to count numbers. Is that the question? No. <laughs> what question am I looking at? She said, Donna, could I please get the clothing and jewelry dibble box instead of the one you described to me? Please and thank you. Sorry. Oh, sure. Um, so let's see. I'm going to change Maury to a dibble box of clothing. Got you. Got you, got you. Um, yeah, so, oh, you think it was like one of those homeschool things? Okay. That's what somebody said. Okay. Oh, it still exists. Wait, I lost it. Where it says, it used to be a technical institute. Oh, okay. Oh, they still exist, huh? Oh, thank you, Maury. Thank you so much. Okay. All right. Are we done looking at this? We're going to call it. We're going to go once and twice. This is my lot number six. 
and then we call this old magazines. And Kyle Elliott is at 60. Connie is out. Josh, let us know. Donna, do you want to switch the lot number then for that clothing double box to be six? Um, for Maury? Um, no, it's um, I had Maury as number two as a dibble box from, from last week, but I just changed, I just added clothing dibble box. Okay, thanks. Thank you. 65 to Josh Noon. Hey, Ruth Bond, 70 to Kyle Elliott. Thanks, guys. <clears throat> Ooh, I didn't even see that face in the, see it? Oh, wow. It was like blended in the background. <clears throat> I didn't even see it the first time around. Epic novel of haunted treasures. Oh, is she naked? Oh, no. She's got something on her. Oh, in the UK. It was founded in 1989 in Scranton, Pennsylvania. The UK branch was set up in 1904, and it now serves around 20,000 current students. Oh, that's interesting that they're still around since the 19, I don't know, that one was 1955. So not that long ago. That, that's not that long ago that they were around. Very cool. All right, Josh is at 80. Boy, the, um, the graphics on there are pretty crazy. What is that smoke around those soldiers? I wanna look. We can call it. Science fiction stories are probably of good high quality. It almost looks like flowers. But I guess it's smoke. Yeah, the graphic on these is awesome. The warplanes flying by. The big bomb. Sold, sold, sold to Josh Noons. All right, Josh. Thank you so much. All right, T, you can go ahead. Okay. All right, let's do some video games. Um <clears throat> I'm missing a case for this one. I was trying to look for it, but I don't have it. It's PlayStation 2 American Idol. I'll see if I can put it in a temporary case. PS3 Grand Turismo. Uh, video and book. PS3 Madden NFL 13. Just the game. PS3 NBA 2K12. Book and game, NBA 2K14, book and game, which just fell out. <laughs> awesome, Siggy. Awesome. Hi, Siggy. NBA 2K15, game and book, NBA 2K16, game and book. Another one that does not have a case, Atari NBA Backyard Basketball, PlayStation 2 Airborne Troops, oh wow, Vintage Memories, Ghost Recon, PlayStation 2, Ghost Recon 2, PlayStation 2, so you got one and two there, Medal of Honor, Front line. Medal of Honor Rising Sun. Sorry, got lazy there. Wasn't opening them for you. So you got the book with that one. Let me make sure. I think you get the book with this one too. Yep. 
and the recon too. I think the book is in there as well. Yep. Okay. Kill Zone PlayStation 2 game and book. PlayStation 2 ATV Off Road Fury game and book. Vintage Memories says, wow, just got the notification from YouTube that the auction is live 53 minutes late. Someone call Wes. Let him know that there's an auction going on. <laughs> uh, this is a PC DVD, Thrillville Off the Rails. Just the game. We Disney Force, just the game. We... 101 party me mega mix number one disc and game xbox 360 baja 1000 i think this is just oh no book and game project gotham racing xbox game and book Deadly Island Riptide Xbox game and book. So you got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21 games in total. And we have Josh at 55. Right? The notifications you're talking about, Bluegrass? I know. It's crazy. Junebug, if you can... Thank you, Jim Bug. Okay. All right. We're going to call it to Josh at 55. Awesome deal. T's roulette wheel is spinning like crazy tonight. Oh, you mean we're... Oh, sorry, Heidi. Really? We're buffering? That stinks. Sorry. What are you sorry about? She said we're buffering like crazy. Oh, we are? Ooh, what's that? Batman, uh, like, I guess, collectible cards. I'm not counting them. There's four stacks of whatever that is. <laughs> oh. Huh. Um, Josh bought them for $55. No, no. Josh bought the video games. Oh. This oh, is oh, my you second time. <laughs> Your fan. No, it's not bad. Just hear it sometimes. Oh, let me fix it. I didn't actually fix it. I didn't actually fix it tonight. I can fix it. I, well, I can't fix it. I can maybe calm it down a little bit. I kind of have a little a little secret that's been working. Maybe it works. Maybe it doesn't work. You'll let me know if you hear it anymore. I think that helps. I heard it. What? I, I didn't hear it. No? Mm -mm. Predator is back. <laughs> let me know if you hear it now. 
All right, so these are the cards. There are four stacks of this amount. I, if somebody can help me know where the years on these are. Oh, wait, I think I know where the years are. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. What vintage memories changed their um, profile picture to a big number four? Yeah. What does that mean? I don't know. What does it mean, vintage memories? Number four. Looks like 1992. 92. 92, guys. And it's fixed. Yeah, it's gone. Good. Oh, you were playing last night that everyone should be a number. Is that why Shriker's a 20? No, Shriker's always been a 20. No, but his profile picture wasn't. Oh, that's there. right. I, that's right. He's a 20. <laughs> what do you want to start this lot at, T? Well, we'll start it at 25 since jo Josh said Batman cards $25 bid. <laughs> okay, thanks. Thanks, Josh. <laughs> All right. So there's four stacks of these. Again, I mean, I'll, I'll flip through a few of them if you want me to. Again, just so you guys can get an idea of how many there are. Um, I really don't feel like counting them. <laughs> it didn't. It didn't help. Vintage memories. We're still confused now about the numbers. <laughs> oh dear Lord, help me! They are tops. They are tops. Sorry, I'm late to rock. What's that? Uh, I'm ready to rock and roll, he says. Okay. He was in the car and his, I think, or his phone or something was on 1%, he said. Oh. Uh, something happened. Yes, I did. I, I, I'm I, just not going to promise. I'm going to try, Miss Synonymous. I'm absolutely going to try. I kind of overextended myself on DVDs. Sorry. But if anybody needs CDs, I'll do the same deal. That's the other deal I'll do if anybody wants to do a deal of CDs. What What was the deal that you were doing on the DVDs? 50 for 25, but I'm out of them. I don't have any more left. Yeah, it was a great deal. That's a great deal. I don't know what I have in the storage unit, but I'll let you know after I go back tomorrow and look. But I'll do the same deal on CDs if anybody wants to cash in on those. And Bluegrass says those CDs were awesome. They are. I mean, you get really decent ones. Um, I, I know it sounds funny, everything from Mozart to rap, but those are the two categories that, that sell the best, classical and rap. <laughs> really? Yeah. You would think rock would. I mean, rock does, but the higher-end stuff, believe it or not, and the off-the-wall stuff, which a lot of it is off-the-wall stuff. So I know Anthony has a, a reseller booth at like a co-op. Does does Josh have one too? I don't know. Josh, do you have one also? A reseller booth? No, they're going to be mixed. I mean, if it, the only thing I will accept, to be honest with you, if you tell me you don't want rap. Like you can't tell me you want all rap. But if you tell me you want no rap, that I'll accept. <laughs> Are these 1997 tops? 92. And we'll double check them again, but I swear that's the year we saw was 92. We'll look again. Saxton, she's going to do 50 uh, CDs, right? For $25? Yep. 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 50 CDs for $25, Saxton. Yes. 1992 on these. 
Oh, my boots are rolling great these last five months. Awesome, Anthony. Wow, that's, that's so great. good to hear. That's so All good. All right, Rosen. Okay. Mama G, could you make that the next, what are we on? Six? Five? Six. Would you make lot number six, um, Cindy Rosen? Josh says that um, the CD lot that he got from you was awesome, T. Awesome. I'm, I'm, I'm so glad. Saxton said she'll take one too. Is Mama G here? Um, Mama G? I was muted. I'm here. I'm here. Okay. So Cindy Rosen is six, right? Correct. Cindy Rosen's now six. And then lot number. And Saxton seven is going to be a CD lot for Saxon Cole. Okay. And Mrs. Anonymous, no wrap. Okay, I can do that. $25. $25, Iris. Are we going to go with lot? Yeah, just keep going down with the numbers. It's fine. All right. I need, is Mrs. Anonymous wanting one? Yes, just right next to hers, no wrap. Iris, Iris wants one, but she said no wrap. Okay. I wouldn't be able to tell the difference. But oh. number T9 is going to go to Iris. Okay. Is that right? Yep. Saxton said she'll take all the wrap. Well, see, I can't do that because that's not fair. I mix it up. You'll, you'll get your, trust me, you'll definitely get your money's worth. Believe me. <laughs> well, Josh said he wants one too. Sorry. <laughs> That's it's okay. a fair amount of rap. The, the boys will tell you. Bluegrass and Josh will tell you for sure. She's okay. just thinking, why not? I'll take the ones they don't want. <laughs> I will accommodate the best I can. Cindy Rosen wants two. Okay. Two lots for Cindy. Yep. Just leave that the same lot number. Just put times two is fine. Tom Cruise. Hey, what about me? Says Mimi Resells. Okay. You got it, Mimi. Thanks, Denise. Now you're going to need more CDs. No, no. You get tons. Do you? All right, you guys, buy them up. If you order two lots, she'll throw in 10 extra CDs. How's that sound? Say Is it again. If, if they buy two lots, right, she'll throw in an extra 10 CDs. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, giving your stuff away. All right, so, can we tell this? <laughs> if you make... If you make it, okay. if you make I it. I told you, you, Mama G. I told you we were going to be crazy. Tonight. Saxton Cole says, do two for me, T. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Saxton Cole. You go, Saxton Cole. <laughs> Boom. And Who else wants I, two? Okay. I, hey, hey, hey. All right, wait, wait. Hey. wait. <laughs> Donna. <laughs> Sorry, T. I'll, I'll mute myself. I'll mute Iris. Myself <laughs> <laughs> Iris, then Josh. Then Cindy Rosen wanted to. And then who was the other person after that? Okay. So. <laughs> Kyle. <laughs> all right. So the very first one was Cindy Rosen. And then she decided she wanted to. All right. She, Saxon Cole wants to as well. Yes. <laughs> Saxton. And now Denise wants to. And Cindy, wait. <laughs> All right. I have Cindy Rosen as lot six. Lot seven is Saxon Cole. Lot eight is Mrs. Anonymous. Lot nine with no rap is Iris. Lot 10 is Josh. Then it comes back to Cindy wanted two lots. Mrs. But I thought Anonymous I missed wants two lots. 
This is anonymous. Also said no rap. Yeah. Right, Kyle. And Denise. Mimi resells. Mimi resells. Yeah. She wants That's two now. One. That's the one I was missing. Okay. Iris just wants one. Okay. And Melissa Cape wants one now. Evil Lenny. Hey, Melissa Evil Lenny. Cape. Melissa Cape wants one. And Pammy wants what Donna's drinking. <laughs> <laughs> it's called what? lunch. T <laughs> T12 then. Okay. Is Melissa Cape. Okay. I'll let you guys know if she yells at me after the show. <laughs> I'm not going to yell at you. Anything else you got you want me to sell for you? <laughs> or give away? <laughs> Vintage memories I'm going to do with Dibble. Don't worry. Back to the auction lot we are auctioning. I've got Josh at 39. And All I'm right. looking for any other advance. All right. Any other advance? If you were bidding and you didn't type out, please type out and we'll sell them. 1992 Batman cards. And Mimi wants a drink. Me too. Me too. Evil Lenny, I hope you had a good day at work with my son. <laughs> Evil Lenny's asking if you got his box yet, Donna. If I got what box? No, I haven't gotten a box. Mm -mm. No, Evil Lenny. Mm -mm. Right. Shoot, Donna. Come promote me. You're hired. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Evil Lenny. <laughs> Thanks, Connie. I'm always a proud mommy because he's such a hard worker. Thank you, secret agent. All right, we're sold to Josh Nunez for 39. All right, I have, whoops, oh, well, I had. I have a box of electronics. Let me tell you what I have. So we have some remotes. I think that's all. Oh, no, there's another one. Hey, Sandy Kirk. What do you want to start this out at? 25? Yeah. Tea. Okay. Yeah. My husband just got home. Are you kidding me? Mm -mm. And guess what we're having for dinner? Grapes. He better have bought me grapes. <laughs> I thought that's what you were eating right now. <laughs> no, I'm eating, I'm eating another Tums. He bought, he bought steak. That's not good. Why is that not good? I love steak. I only have steak like once a month. All right, I'm looking to see first of all if we have any more electron, uh, uh, any more remotes, and then we'll move on to what else is in here. Oh my God, I'm so excited for dinner. It's a big box, guys. It's definitely a big box. It's a nice reseller's lot. All right, so there are one. No. Shelly, we have salmon pretty Two, often. Often. Three. Four. Oops. Five. 
six and seven remotes. Then we're going to have, this looks like this is a, like a pro mini, like a, a Palm Pilot, something like that. Not 100% sure. It says pro mini on it. So you got that. This is a brother home and hobby P touch. It, it was Cindy's. <laughs> um, I guess it's some kind of printer because it's brother model PT brother, brother model PT 86, I think. Let me look. Let me look. Let me look better. PT65. PT65 on that one. Okay. What is Josh saying? Texas Instruments on this one? No, but there's some coming up. I don't know. This Pro Mini is a Magic Pro. That's what this one says. I'm not sure about this one. This is a Texas instrument. This is just a regular kind of solar calculator. This is a Royal Flush poker machine. This is a solitaire machine. This is a battleship game. He is a sharp solar calculator. TI Math Explorer. It doesn't want to go back in. All right, we'll leave a teal pool with it later. This is old, 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 old. This looks familiar too. Columbia Electronic Calculator. God knows. It was probably one of the first ones out there. <laughs> Who knows? That's old. That's heavy, actually. That's funny. This is a money changer. I don't know. It's in here, so I'm putting it with this stuff. This looks like a couple of backs. I'll make sure all the backs, if I if I have the back, you'll get the back for sure. What is this? It's a stereo cassette adapter for an 8-track tape. I don't know. We'll throw it in there. It was in this box. CA48DC 1.5 volt Japan. I bet you get a few That's cool. That. I bet you get a few bucks for that one. And we have I have sold so many um, of those like when I used to sell on eBay they're an easy sell thank you secret agent Lloyd's Acumatic 304 battery compartment looks clean So if you're into selling electronics, this is a good lot. This is a good lot. This is still in the box. Sharp El Samate EL205. Still in the box. Look at that. And this must be some something for a computer. Looks like memory, possibly. It says microscope. Oh, it's a hard drive for Xbox. Oh, it's an Xbox hard drive. That's what that is. Again, I'm not guaranteeing any of it works, but it's in here if you need it. Can you hear me, T? What, honey? Um, Eva Lenny said, T, I sent a guy. His name is Sammy. He's a hot wheel guy. So I told about told 
about your options if he comes and probably mention my name. Okay. So a guy named Sammy who's into Hot Wheels. All right. Um, and then there looks like there is a Seeper Plus and a GE remote of some sort. And the last thing is first alert. And that empties the box. All right, so you got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <laughs> I'm sorry, Josh. What? <laughs> what? Nine. <laughs> Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25 pieces in here, guys. Twi oh, wait. I forgot something. I don't even know what's in this box. Let's see what it says. Talking autopilot with, I don't know, maybe a Palm Pilot? Not sure. Let's see. The directions and everything are in here. This looks like it may have never even been out of the box. It looks like it was never used. You know, it's actually 26 now pieces in that. What am I missing? What am I missing? <laughs> <laughs> You'd have to scroll back up. Oh, no, I deleted my comment because I put, instead of Josh, I put Jose. And I don't know how I did that, but it I did it. And then he says... I know my last name is, but my first name isn't Jose. <laughs> it's all good. It's all good. All right. Siggy is out. Connie's at 70. I think he's Just out. out. Yes, because I put thanks Eddie, Thursday noon. Eddie, you are <laughs> lagging so bad. Eddie's like nice lot of Batman. <laughs> oh no. Eddie, refresh. That's crazy. <laughs> okay, so now we're gonna go once. Oh, we sold to Connie? Is it Connie now? Yeah, Connie's at 70. All right. <laughs> Electronic lot to Connie. All right, Donna, you're up. All right, T, I'm gonna do something that's not normally what we do, and I didn't talk. I didn't talk to you about it. Um, well, as long as you're gonna keep your shirt on, we're okay. <laughs> okay. So this is what I'm going to do. Since it's getting so close to Easter time, I have these beautiful rosaries. I'm going to offer them up. Okay. I, I just wanted to open up my PayPal. I'm going to offer them up, but I'm going to do a, I'm going to do a pain now because I don't want to 
spend the time sending an invoice and I'm not going to send tracking numbers with them either. I'm going to just put them in an envelope with stamps and I'm going to send them like tomorrow. So I'm going to watch the transactions. And as long as you pay, when I hold it up, write me, I'm going to put your name on the bag and it's going to get sent out. Okay. All right. So <clears throat> I have 20 of them, you guys. Um, okay, we're going to need everybody to refresh your chat right now. And I'm going to put my PayPal in the chat. Um, Make sure I'm on the right account. I was trying to get all set. So there's no combined shipping, nothing with these. These are just going to go straight out by themselves. I mean, if there's, if I have something here, that's, if I have something here, but I'm not going to pay, you know, $2.88 or whatever it is to ship them out. I'm just going to put like three stamps on them and, and send them out because they're lightweight. Okay. So um, are we going to count this as your lot number Seven? Yeah, for all of them. For all of them. So lot seven, A, B, C, D. Yeah, and I'm just going to watch and make sure that the payments come in and they're just going to get... Okay, so... Um, so let's see. First, let me do it this way. First, let me, let, first, let me say... Let me sh let me show them to you. And if you guys just want to be surprised, so to save time, so that I don't have to go one by one and you say me, if you just want to be surprised with what you get, you guys can go ahead and write me in the chat and I'll write how many me's are in the chat. I'd like to do them for $10 each. Okay. And this is what I have. Um, none of them are plastic. They're all glass or wood or pearl or some sort of bead. Okay. And I have 20 of them. So $10, $10 each for the rosaries. And since it's getting so close to Easter, I thought I would, I would offer them up. So for those of you that want to go ahead and just be, um, to get a mystery one, um, Valerie, so I won't be, um, I won't be sending invoices. So if you send the payment right there, that would be great. Are you going to keep track of it for me? That's awesome. Mama G. Okay. So anybody else? Angela Sanborn would like two. two of them to Angela. Okay, so let me write this down so I know to back out. Okay, I'm going to give this one and try not to do them just so they wouldn't be tangled. What a fiasco. Okay, this one. This one and this one to Angela. Angela Sanborn. One and two. Okay, next. Valerie wants one. Valerie Gelmish. is gonna take i mean they're really beautiful like look at look at how pretty this is this double one is absolutely gorgeous okay nice yeah really pretty okay so those are the only pre-orders you guys want to see the rest is there any interest okay so i have this one just write me in the chat if you want it hold on i moved my screen so i don't know where my camera is there's this one here, which is very beautiful. 
Donna, secret yeah. agent said, I would like one, please. I will pay now. Um, secret agent, I don't know how I'm going to send it to you in, um, to England. I mean, I can't, I can't, it's, it's going to be, it's going to have to, I'm going to have to do them just in the U S. Um, because it's going to cost a lot of money probably to send to England on this, unless you want to pay the shipping on it. Hi, Jonathan Roseberry. Okay. No interest in this one. No one said me. Okay. So how about this one? This one's all metal. Oh, no, it's not. It's pearls. It's pearls and metal. Flipping hot finds, me. Thank you. Okay. The next one is this one, which is. Hey, Matt Jones. It's all wood. It's an all wood, very kind of like bohemian style. First me gets this one. Ten dollars. Give it another minute. If there's no interest, we'll pull out another one. Okay. Next one is this one. This one is some sort of red beads. Um, okay. I would burn if I held one of those. <laughs> Saxton. Anybody? Okay, secret agent. I can send it to T. Thank you, secret agent. Absolutely. T. I want the wood one, then I'll give it to my son. You want the wood one? Mm -hmm. Pretty. Okay, anybody want the red? Pass on the red. T's going to take the wood. <laughs> oh, my God. I can't even. Oh <laughs> that you guys didn't know that about T. Is Courtney here? Shh. Yep. Thank God Susan's taking a nap. Okay. This is the next one. I don't know. This is very, very lightweight. It almost feels like a wood also. And it says Italy on the back of it. A me in the chat. <laughs> Vintage memory, Donna holding rosaries. Yes. We'll give it two minutes, two seconds. Hey, hey, Goose. Hey, Goose. Me. Actually, Miss work. Okay. Let me G drop the um drop the um my eat my Kuzi Watsi, please. What well, gotta hold up? Steven resells. Because I don't no, want actually Sergeant Spork says me actually before Steven sells. Oh Sergeant Spork? Yes, yeah, has the dark wooden piece right there. Okay. Sorry, Steven. Spork. Yeah. All right. The next one is this one. Saxton, that should be no surprise. <laughs> I'm trying to hold them delicately. That's the next one. Like a moonstone color. Yeah. It looks like it has flashing in it. See it? Yep. I don't know if it's, you know, like um, whatever that, have to ask the jewelry people. $10. Mm -hmm. 
pay now, you guys, please. I don't want to have to invoice for all of these. It will take me forever. Josh, Josh you know. Thank you, Josh. Josh Noons. It's a really pretty one, Josh. Good for you. It's awesome. I mean, they're all beautiful, but okay. This one is black. This one reminds me of my grandmother. It says Italy on it. She always had a black rosary in her hand. Always. This is the next one. Very masculine. Oh, I don't know if it's abalone. I have no idea. Looking for me. Possible oak light. Maybe, John. I don't know. Okay, we're going to pass if nobody wants it. Sergeant Spork wants it. Donna, I am having an issue here. What's the matter, honey? My computer's not wanting to send through the thing um okay so josh has the moonstone one um josh got the moonstone one and sergeant spork is getting this black one okay thank you christopher thank you so much for the payment i received the payment okay the next one is this one, which is so pretty, it's like a raspberry color, like a, well, like a rose color. It's like more like a cranberry color. I'm trying to hold the cross so you can see it. There you go. Looking for me. Wish I had gotten my grandmother's rosary beads. They were super old. Yeah, some of these might be old. I don't know. This one looks pretty new, though. Okay, thank you so much, Secret Agent. Elizabeth wants it. Thank you, Elizabeth. Elizabeth. All right. Thank you again, secret agent. Thank you. Okay, that one goes to Elizabeth. And next I'm going to do this one, which is, I don't know if it's a child's or what the deal is with this. And I did not check it. But look at how dainty this is. It's so small and dainty. It's a little, little tiny one. On this one. Um, I don't know, Josh, I think. I think it said Italy on it. I don't know if this one says anything on it. Is anybody, Elizabeth, you want these little dainty ones too? Okay. Elizabeth's bag is here. Okay, that's going to Elizabeth. Thank you, Elizabeth. And here's another. Let go. This one's beautiful. This one is really, really, really beautiful also. This one is all metal beads. There's the cross on it. Just even a nice gift to give to someone for Easter. And some people wear them as necklaces. I know Frenchie does. Frenchie wears hers as a necklace. Dawn, you want this one, honey? It's beautiful. All right, this one's going to Don. Hey, Don. Thank you, Don. Guys, please don't forget to send the payment. 
so I don't have to do invoicing on these. I can just ship them out. Donna, what was the last one you had that you just sold to Don? It was all metal. No. All metal? Yes, it was all metal. Okay, now this one looks like plastic to me. This one does not look like some sort of stone. But it's still pretty. It's flat. Instead of round, they're flat beads. And it's like a cranberry color. Oh, is it, well, me, or, is it me or does she keep from freezing, Mama G? Um, always business. Always I see her fine. Oh, maybe it's me then. Goods and services always. Never friends and family, please. Oh, you did, Angela? That's okay. Yeah, but you guys, from now on, always send it for goods and services. Okay. No one wants that one. And, okay, are we done, you guys? Is there any other interest? Are we done looking at these? Because this is what I'm going to do with the rest of them. I'm going to turn it into a, let me see, where's that other one? I have two up there. Um, oh, I guess I only have one. I had two. Was there any other interest before I do this as a reseller lot, the rest of them? Mm -hmm. Oh, no. How do I charge that? Change that. You don't have to change it. It's okay. All right. So is anybody else interested in a single piece before I do the rest of these as a lot? I just wanted to give everybody uh, an opportunity to buy one if they wanted one. No. Okay. So the rest of them I'm going to do as a reseller lot. Anybody who wants to buy them for reselling. So there's one, two, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's nine, nine of them left. And I'll include this little testament, but it is inscribed in front, this little Bible. Okay. There's nine of them left. Can I see the blue one? That's the blue one. All right, so if you're um, not interested in the blue one, all right, I'm going to start this and all of these for $20. Oh, this looks like a locket. Oh, look at this one. This one's very interesting. Look at it. It's like you can put something in there. See it? A locket? Like? Huh. I wonder if it's like for a little of um, anointing oil or something. I don't know. I don't know how to open it. Donna. What? Um, the blue one. To Iris? Yes. So it's going to be. All right. So I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't have jumped the gun and just tried to get rid of all the rest of them. Because look at Don would like another one too. Okay, the blue one's going to go to Iris. I don't know if Iris... Iris just says, I like that blue one. I don't know if she said she... Oh, I don't know if she said... Iris wrote, I like that blue one. Did Mrs. She have Anonymous says blue one. Well, Don said me. Got friend. it. Sorry. Who got it, who got it first? Don? 
Don said me first. I think so. Don said me first. I'm sorry, Mrs. Anonymous. Don said me first. I see it. <laughs> I forgot I had that here. <laughs> all right. So let's just keep going then. Let's just keep going and see before I auction them all off. Let's see if anybody else wants, wants any more of them. I'm sorry, I jumped the gun because I feel like it was taking too long. I don't want T yelling at me. You know, Donna, stop it. Don't make me like I'm the bad guy. I'm fine. <laughs> this one, the red one? one. I think I showed this from Everybody's the beginning. Everybody's probably going to think I'm the mean girl. Level failed, yes. <laughs> <laughs> and it's funny, it's funny that that noise played just as I was like, oh, maybe I jumped the gun and I shouldn't have done this. <laughs> Maybe a relic holder. Which one was that one? Did I sell that one? What happened to it? I must have sold it. It must have been one of the ones that just sold. Because I don't see it here now. The little one with the locket? Yeah. Oh, here That's it is. That's the one you set for Don. You set no. that one aside. No, 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 no. The blue one. Don wanted the blue one. I know such weird timing, right? Okay. Don, oh, did you Anonymous wanted the locket one? She wanted this one. Oh, oh, Mrs. Anonymous, you want this one? Okay. All right. Got it. And she already got one, right? She has a bag. Thank you, Secret Agent. That's T. That's Angela. Do you have a bag, Mrs. Anonymous? Did you already tell me you wanted one? I don't have a bag for you. Flipping it fine. Secrets. Don saying that's the one he wanted. Don. Oh boy, I'm mixing everything up. That's the problem with the lag, unfortunately. All right. Okay, Don, you didn't want the blue one, right? So who wanted the blue one? Did if, if somebody wanted the blue one, please type blue in the chat and let's give it a moment. Okay. Who who was the first one to say they wanted the one with the Don? Well, we had me in for Don, and then and then Mrs. Anonymous said, I want that one, but I thought she was talking about the blue one. Kyle, you're confused. <laughs> Don said no to the blue one. Okay. Richard's like Donna selling bags. <laughs> All right, who's the first one to claim this one? Okay, okay, Ms. Anonymous wanted both of them, so. Oh, she wanted both of them. Carrie. All right, well, we're going to give Don that one, and we're going to give Ms. Anonymous the blue one to be fair, I think. Is that okay, Mrs. Anonymous? I'll show you. I'll show you more. Okay, I'm going to give this one to Don. I'm going to give this one to Don. Okay. Don gets that one. And then Mrs. Anonymous gets the blue one. Okay. Mrs. Anonymous gets the blue one. And because things got messed up, I'm going to give you this one for free, Mrs. Anonymous. Okay. How's that? So you get two for the price of one. Is that fair? Thumbs up. Good. It's all good karma now. Right? Jesus, take fair? the wheel. Yes. Are you happy with that? I hope. Okay. So this is what I have left. Might as well go through them. This one feels like it's some sort of wood as well. An organizer person. Stephen, what do you think I'm trying to do? <laughs> it's hard with the leg, guys. It's really hard with the leg. Just bear with us. Okay. Does anybody want this wooden one? And maybe what we'll have you guys do, if this is the one you want, Sergeant Spork wants that one. Okay, Sergeant Spork. You got it, honey. Thank you. More Sergeants. Okay, 
Sergeant's Pork is going to take that one. And then there's this one, which is also appears to be. A Annie, they're $10 each. This one appears to be um, some sort of wood also. Let me see. It says Italy on it. They probably, a lot of them probably say Italy on them. I just didn't look. There's that one. Did you see the way they fell out of my hands just then? No, Did you keep freezing side? on me. I guess it's me. Mama G, she's not freezing on you? No, but I'm watching YouTube more than the stream yard. Okay. I'm not, Josh. I'm not looking. If they are, bless your heart, if, they, if they're silver. Okay, nobody wants this one? All right, nobody wants that one. Nobody wants this one? This is the flat one. This is the one that I think is plastic. Pretty sure it is. Nobody wants this one. This one? is pearl nini did anyone see my question no pearl uh, white nini. towels I th are those white towels behind you sold they're pink nope they're not sold i brought them out to bring them to auction i just haven't had a chance mama g fell out she did you okay, okay whoops you okay mama g I had to because my stream yard froze. Okay. okay. There's yeah, I feel like stream yard's given me a problem. I don't know why. I don't know what kind of beads these are. You can see the variation in color. I don't know if they're wood or or what they are, but there's this one. Evil Lenny said some of those can be really old coffee beans as well. Oh, these look like coffee beans. Oh, that's what they are. That's what they are. They're coffee beans. These are coffee beans. A hundred percent. They are coffee beans. They have to be. That is so funny because they're lightweight. Okay. Nobody wants these coffee beans. You don't want to suck on them in the morning when you wake up. Oh my God. <laughs> when you don't have time to do, to have your, make your coffee. <laughs> Mary Palantir is like, huh? <laughs> what are you talking about? He's gone mad. Thank okay. you, secret agent. Thank you. All right. So this is it. This is what's left. One, two, three, four, five rosaries and the little testament. Thank you, Mrs. Anonymous. And the little testament um, Bible, $10 start. $10 start. Here's your, um, here's your, here's your passage to heaven. I'm joking. I don't know where that came from. $10 start for the rest of it. Donna, why are they yelling? I don't know. Why is, Sin why is Sandy yelling? Oh, my God. I don't know, because I said little passage to heaven, because it's a Bible and a bunch of rosaries. All right, Sergeant Sporks in for 10, looking for 12. 12 from Mrs. Anonymous, 15 from Josh. Um, Mama G, this is going to be my lot number seven. This is lot eight, Donna. Why? Because yeah. lot seven was all of those individuals. Okay. Now okay, we've got okay, this okay. in the Bible. Okay. 17 to Dawn, Sergeant Spork is out. Josh and Mrs. Anonymous, let us know. We need 1920 from Josh. Hey, Carl. Hi, Carl. I can't spell Josh's name right. <laughs> That's all right. He, he's okay with Jose. <laughs> Don's in at 22. 
Mrs. Anonymous is out. Josh, let us know. Okay, I got Mrs. Anonymous. I got Elizabeth. I got Pamela. I got Christopher. And I got Angela. You got two, Sergeant Spork. You've got two. Yep. Okay, yep. let's call it. Hey, Tony. Hi, Tony. Donald, even Lenny asked about coffee bean necklace a few times. Uh-oh, I'm sorry. I didn't see it. No, I didn't either. I didn't see his comment. And I've been looking. I think he said something about it being coffee bean. I know think yeah, I that, that he said it I saw that. he wanted one. Is there four total here? I don't know. They're a tangled mess now. There's one, two, <laughs> three, oh, that's funny, Mrs. Anonymous. four, what'd she say? Five. She said, I sent an email to my mother-in-law yesterday and it auto-signed, have a great day, love Mrs. Anonymous. <laughs> Her mother-in-law was probably like, huh? Why are you doing that? <laughs> okay, so there's one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five. There's five of them. There's five of them in the Bible. And the high bid is Don. Yes. At 22. For how much? 22. Okay. However, Josh said, I thought Evil Lenny won the coffee rosary bean. He said he was looking for one to replace the one his mom had. Evil Lenny, are you still in the chat? Here's the coffee bean one. Well, it's going to be up to the winner. Who's the winner? As of right now, Don is the winner at 22. And if Evil Lenny really wants the coffee bean one, I will send Don. I have rosaries too if he wants to take a, a, a another pair from me when I send him his next lot. <laughs> Kyle. <laughs> but I don't see Evil Lenny in here. It's hard, you guys. It's hard, like to do like these kind of like buy it now stuff. It always it it's always difficult, right? Yeah. Team? Yes. And then and then it's difficult for the billing and the shipping. Yep. You have no idea. Well, I just sold sold it to Don. Don said, "Pull the coffee bean out of it and give it to Evil Lenny." That's all. I'll make it up to Don on his next order. So we're good. So this good. one is. I can make it up. I can make it up to John. I can do it too. All right. No, because I have some rosary beads too as well that I had on this. I, I don't have any like right. I just got rid of all my rosary beads, but I can I can make it up to him something else. Okay, so this is going to so this is going to the rosary beads and Bible is going to Dawn for twenty two, you said, right? Yes. Okay. In the coffee one is going to go to Evil Lenny. Okay. I have an Iris bag here that's empty. Iris didn't, she didn't win something, right? Because I wrote her name and then she didn't win another one. So I think that she didn't have a chance to win another one. Okay. So this she is said she didn't want it. Yeah. So this is Evil Lenny. Okay. So the copy. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Thank you, secret agent. I just got some money from you. Thank you so much. No rosaries. Okay. I wanted a box of 
something for 20 i wanted a box of something for 25 dollars well she ordered the cds for 25 yeah Josh Noons, just so nice of you. I'm gonna take care of I'm gonna take care of Don. Don and I go way back. Nothing, Elizabeth. Absolutely nothing. Don't anybody, <coughs> don't anybody tell her, please. All right, you guys. That was awesome. T, take it over. It's all okay. yours, baby. Sorry that took forever and a day. Stop apologizing. Donna, it's all good. It's Saturday night. It's all good. No worries. We're not going to, you know. Well, you know what? I was going to do them as a lot, but I thought to myself, you know what? Easter's coming, and, you know, I don't know how many religious people we have in the chat, but I thought it would be a nice thing, you know, just a quick $10, like, nice little Eastery thing. I was going yeah. to going to offer them up in, like, Easter baskets next week, because that's what I'm going to offer is Easter baskets with goodies, but... I don't know. Maybe I'll find something else that's, you know, religious that I can put in there. And then I kind of struggle with that, too, because I don't know if, you know, not everybody's religious. So they may not want a religious thing in a basket, but they may want the chocolates and the candies and stuff like that. So you guys stay tuned for next week. I'm going to have some awesome, awesome Easter baskets. All right. All right. I'm going to do some comics, guys. It's Frank here. Hi, Peaches. Of course, Frank's here. Hey, Peaches. All right. Batman 505. The Punisher 43. The Punisher 67. A lot of Punishers. The Punisher 64. The Punisher 65. Avengers 355. The Punisher 2099, number 5. Bloodshot, number 9. Annual 1990 Detective Comics, number 3. The Secret Defenders, number five. 20, 20, 20 casual flipper. Um, Doom, 2099, number eight. The Golden Age, James Robinson, Paul Smith, Richard Orry, DC. I don't see a oh, book two on this one. Four X Force twenty two. Adventures of Superman thirty one. No, five oh five. Sorry. What is that saying? 31 there. Oh, it's 505. Sorry. The Punisher War Zone, number one. Whoops. Doom 2099, number one. Ghost Rider, number six. Part two of two. Um, all right, we're going to put that one aside till the end because I think I have to, oh, I think I have to open that one. Solitaire number two, Ultraverse, Gambit, I don't see a number, oh, here it is, number three. Ghost Rider, number 18. T, Josh is saying might be error on the last book. Well, three books ago now. Uh, 
Uh, can you tell me the name? If you can tell me the name, Josh, I'll go back to it, honey. Speed Racer number two. Superman 694. The Adventures of Superman 507. The one that I said had no number. Didn't I find the number after the fact? Mama G, didn't I find the number after the fact or was I losing my mind? I don't know because I was losing my mind over the rosaries trying to get them all put in oh, order. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So I didn't pay attention. Sorry. No Josh, they all have numbers. I, I think I found, I think that was the Gambit one and I found the number. It was Gambit number three. It was up in the top hand corner. I think that was the one. Or the Golden Age. Maybe the gold. Oh, the Golden Age one just says book two of four. That's what that one says. If that's the one. I'm not sure. We'll go through them again. You'll ask me if you, we're not sure. Oh, look, Alf, 21. Didn't know Alf had a comic. That's he all right. He said, sorry, no. keep going. No, no worries, please. Kissy Fur, number one. <laughs> Kissy Fur. Okay. <laughs> Kissy Fur. 007, James Bonds, 1989. Actually had another one here that was I cut the, the lot off a little short, so let's put that one in here too. Here's another one, James Bond 007. Thank you, Secret Agent. Oh, Donna, stop. So yeah, and the last one is this Robin 2 comic. This one is number three, but I feel like there's more in here, or there might be two copies in here. I never like to open these up, but I am gonna I am gonna open this one up only because I want to know so you guys know exactly what's in here. Oh maybe this I guess it's just the way it is because it is packed in its original um whatever's in here is packed in its original um, bag and it looks like there's specialty cards in here as well donna i'm not yelling at you stop super chatting me are you nuts are you kidding <laughs> come on <laughs> um again so there is a double book in here something with a collector set a hologram trading card in here. Robin 2, issue number 3. And I guess... Oh, I guess it, there's two, two issues in here. That's what it looks like, I guess. Hmm. All right. I just wanted to know because it felt very thick to me. So I wanted you guys to know what was in there. So that's what it is. And it's still in its original thing, but there is a little bit of, it's not perfect. But the book itself is not perfect. Just FYI, there is some rippling. All right. So you got one. Yeah, we'll count that as one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven. Josh, don't go there. <laughs> Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 
26, 27, and 28. 28 books in total. If there's any in there that you want to see again, just let me know. But thank you guys. We have casual in at 40. Just looking to see if Jose wants to come back in. Oh, he does at 43. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you guys have been hanging out with Brian too long. Hey, Craig, 45 from Casual Flipper. <laughs> Oh, thank you, Amy. <laughs> Amy knows. <laughs> Amy, I think I'm still sitting on something of yours. It's a poster or two posters. A $10 Tuesday item. Let me know. If you uh, you want them, I'll, 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 it won't be much for shipping, but let me know. can't remember who it is off the top of my head now. I know it's a country singer. I just can't remember who. I don't, unfortunately. Just did a DVD special, though, Craig, if you're interested. 50 for 25 if you want. Yeah, I want to think, I don't know, maybe it wasn't you, Amy. I, for some reason, I thought it was you. It was, um, congrats, Josh, that for 47. I'm sorry. Oh, sold. I'm sorry. <laughs> Am I talking too low again? All right. So let's go ahead and put, um, Josh 47. No, you're not talking too low. It's okay. Oh, yeah. I'll take the deal, please. Okay. And then put Craig Wolf down. I lost track of numbers, Mama G. Okay. Um, I had that last comic lot as 15, but um, that's because, or Miss Anonymous is asking about DVDs versus CDs. Yeah, it's a CD deal. I'm sorry if I said DVD. It's a CD deal. CDs. I have no more DVDs, but I have CDs. So it's it's twenty five dollars for fifty CDs. Sorry, CDs. So just confirm that. Craig, confirm that you want music CDs, not DVD movies. Sorry, that was my bad. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. All right, just let us know, Craig. Thank you. All right, I'm going to do a sports lot. To mix he sports. said that's fine. Okay. All right, thank you. So that's going to be lot T16. All right, so we're going to have some football, some baseball, some wrestling, some soccer, some basketball. It's a bunch of um, a mix, a mix, a mix, a mix. I thought I had another stack of football somewhere. Okay. 
Oh, and some hockey. These are hockey. These are hockey tea, not football. It's just sports, right? Okay. All right. All right. Okay. Oh, I knew I had more somewhere. Okay. No, that's not football. I thought I had some football somewhere else, but I don't. Okay. No, we don't. Okay. All right. This is it. I will right, we'll start off with the hockey. Is this going to be a sports card lot? Yes. It's a mixed sports lot. It's not just cards. It's a mixed sports, sports lot and just not cards. There's some books too. I think there's some ring magazines actually. So. We're going to start this at 25? Yeah. That's okay, Carl. Please, don't, you listen. It's fine. Nothing's going anywhere till Monday. I appreciate it. As long as you guys pay by Monday so I can get stuff out of here by Monday, it's all good. Carl, did you go to the beach today? He did. He said he just got in from the beach. Lucky yeah, him. It's nice. We're going to give a Troy Aikman and a Brett Farm in there as well. And we have a pack of these Minute Made soccer cards. Oh, um, Tony, I, I sent out like two invoices this morning after we did our morning show. And then I started cleaning my, my room here and I, I didn't send out any more. So sorry. Tomorrow. Tomorrow I'll send up. These are, I think I sold one of these before. I found another one. Christian Leitner, basketball draft picks. I know I I think I sold another one of these. I just I had I had more, so <coughs> is the computer making noise again, Josh? A little bit, it's purring. This looks like all the same player. Can you show me that check thing again? Sure. So that's the one Mr. Buys a lot was talking about the other day. Yeah, I guess I had two of them. I found another one. Okay, hey, Ronnie. That's, that's a very nice thing to have. Okay. Ronnie G. Hi, Ronnie. And I know I'm going through some of them kind of quick. If you see something and you want me to come back to it, just let me know. Oh my gosh, they're so obsessed with your wheel back there. Sergeant Spork wants to know if that's a giant pig cushion. It's the ball that June bug made. 
Oh, that's the number ball. That's the one yeah. that we should be picking auction numbers out of. <laughs> this, this, we're talking about this? Yep. Yeah. So these, and these then vintage memory files, says and we were doing auction numbers and everybody had a number. I would reach my hand in here and I would pick Cajun Chris resellers number 145. <laughs> Everybody's auction number is in there. <laughs> we'll have to go back to that again. <laughs> I'm sorry we got away from it. It's just that there's so many new people that they don't have auction numbers. I got to work on it again. <laughs> for our giveaways. Yes, Sergeant Spork, your number is still in there. <laughs> if you have an auction number, you're in there. <laughs> oh, Junebug says this channel's got way too big to use that ball. <laughs> you know, I still have my ball too, Junebug. <laughs> I mean, it's like if I have to put another 100 numbers in there, we're in trouble. <laughs> we are definitely in trouble. Casual Flipper, don't pretend like you don't know what we're talking about. You have an auction number. You know you have one. <laughs> you know you have one. Yours is probably less than single digits. <laughs> Some soccer. Wow, Connie. Use a toilet bowl tea. What does that mean? Do you know everyone's number? No, Shelly. Unfortunately, I know who number one is, and she's no longer with us, Donna Wester. Oh. That was Connie her. Connie said number. she's number nine. Yes. Josh is at 45. Is there anybody, anybody else? Anybody else? Any other interest? Tony, was Tony out? No. Let us know, Tony. Craig Wolf. Hmm. You might. I have to look. I don't remember. No, I don't think Craig Wolf does. No. Mm -mm. He's a newbie. Well, not newbie, newbie, but newbie that we didn't assign numbers to him when we were doing the number wheels. <clears throat> the ring what are they all boxing magazines it's not everything it's just a whole bunch of um a whole bunch of um uh, sports stuff boxing soccer basketball baseball it's just uh a little variety, wrestling, yeah. All right. Twenty-seven soccer cards plus the pack of Minute Maid and the soccer. In football, you get the two uh, Brett Favre and Troy Aikman cards plus. The one, two, three, four sheets. Hi, hey, Victoria. Hey, Victoria. The, she the, the basketball, Shaq, Christian Later, Shaq cards, and Christian Later cards. In the hockey, you get the hockey cards. Nice lot. Try 
to mix it up with sports this time rather than to just bring you guys one in case you just want to experiment or you just like a lot of different sports. And then the baseball, two, three, four, five, six sheets on those. So, yeah, that's what you get. I'm going to bring it back to pull the shack card back up, too. You need me to pull the shack card back up again? Yeah, that's a really good card. Looking for that Benjamin. I don't have a bell to ring. I, I do. sold it. <laughs> you just sold it. <laughs> I sold the bell. <laughs> So I, I, have, I, I have I have a sounding device. I get, I, I, I get waiting to do ding, ding, ding. I have a sounding device. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> what else? What else do you got? I don't like any of those. <laughs> no. No. Pac-Man. Oh my god, I heard that sound so many times when I used to play Pac-Man. That's a that's a sad sound. We don't want to use that one. No. Tony's at 110. <laughs> Kyle. You got a horn? I don't have a horn. And we're sold. All right. Sold to Tony. To Tony. Congratulations, Tony. Thank you. All right, Miss Missy. If she mm -hmm. had a horn, she'd still sell that too. <laughs> right? I would. All right, I'm going to do a lot of plush. Let's see what we got for plush. We have Eeyore. He's really, really fluffy. Um, and it is a Disney tag. That's number one. 25 to start. This, I just sold this. I put one of these on eBay, this identical thing I can show you, and I just sold it. I don't know what I sold it for. Um, but it is, it's a gun. Um, and it was, somebody was looking for this and I have another one and I was going to relist it. And I said, ah, I'll just bring it, let you guys list it and you can make the money on it. Um, I have this just a little bunny. It's a Kelly toy. Kelly toy has a nice following. There's a little Kelly toy. And here is a really crazy looking it's a wild republic it's a really crazy looking owl oh my god <laughs> isn't he funny he's got the sparkly eyes but he's uh yeah he's cute so i got the owl and this cute little lion has got its tags on it and it's a gunned little gunned lion and this one, oh my goodness gracious me, it is a Kelly toy and it's a pig dressed up as a bunny. That's cute. Whoever gets this should put this up right away because if anybody loves pigs and people have a thing for pigs. Um, here's another, just, it's just a, what is it? It's a Kelly toy with the plaid, which is adorable. And here we have Kids Preferred. It's a little dragon, Kids Preferred. And next we have a Snoopy. Um, it has its tags on it. Super clean. Nice and clean, nice and white. And... 
this quite a bit here. So what in the world? Oh, you know what this is? This is one of those. Um, it's called warm keys. I think you put this in the, um, I think you put it in the microwave and it warms up and then you can, you know, put it on a spot that you need heat on. It's, it's filled with, you can hear it, something, something inside. You'll have to look it up and see how it's, how it's, yeah, it's a sloth, how it's used. And the next one is this guy here. I hope he works. It's um, Pop Star, it's called. Let's see if he has batteries. No. Nope, he doesn't have batteries. That's a bummer. He probably, he pro oh, he's damaged. He's damaged, you guys. Too bad. Okay, well, he's, he's out. He's not part of the lot. This one is Stuffed Animal House. And it's a teddy bear. And next is this cute little guy. And it's a Boysen's, Boysen bat? Boysenberry, Boysenber, Boysenber. Boysenber. He's like a cranberry colored teddy bear. And this one is called Mango. And I think it's a peekaboo bear because it's got magnetic arms and covers his eyes. And this one is definitely vintage. Um, can't see what the tag says, but it's a vintage. The bow needs to be tied. It's new old stock. You can tell by the tag that it's an oldie. Somebody's looking for that one. And this is a Carter's. Make sure you look for drugs, you guys, if they have pockets. Don't want to get in trouble listing animals with drugs in them. Mama G sent me a story about that. Okay, and this is Flowers Incorporated and Balloons, Adorable Friend of Treasures. This little, by Flowers Incorporated. There's that little bear, and then this one is a bunny tie. And that's the whole lot. That's one, two, three. The Carters is four. The vintage one is five. The peekaboo bear is six. This one is seven. And eight. This one is nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, and 17 for the Demented Owl. And I'll just throw this one in, even though the rain, raincoat is damaged. Um, if you guys get it to work, I'll just throw it in. I'll just throw it into the bundle. All right. I need to know if Mrs. Anonymous is out. Well, Victoria just came in. Oh, thank you, Victoria. Push lot. And I'm going to sweeten the pot and add this one. This is a Florida um, Panthers, Florida Panthers, the hockey team. And it's a Stanley C on the back of it. Okay, that's gonna go in there as well. Okay, <clears throat> Josh is at 57. Okay. 
Um, Victoria comes in at 39. Thank you, Victoria. Guys, to those, those of you that don't know, Victoria has a morning talk show on her channel, uh, 7.30 to 8.30. It's a nice place to go hang out. She's always very lively and full of energy, and um, it's a nice, nice crowd of people go and hang out there. So if you're up having your coffee between 7.30 and 8.30 and you want somewhere to go and hang out, go hang out at Victoria's. A uh, plush lot, MJ. We're bidding on a plush lot. Mixed new and old. Some Disney, some Gund, some Carters. Josh is out. Joy is at 41. Of course, Victoria. I enjoy your show. Twice now. It's to Joy. Joy for 41, congratulations. That is lot number nine, correct? Yes, ma'am. Awesome. Okay, next I'm gonna do a mix of ephemera and photos. So I'll try to go through it quick. I'm gonna show you the stack of it. It's this many and I'll show you quickly what I have. Uh, let's start it at 30, $30. Okay. So here you have number one and I just want to see how beautiful this is. This is all, this is embossed and it's this little girl. And then there are some old Christmas cards in here. Some of them are signed. Some of them are not. There's Valentine's day cards. Guess what I've got for you? This one is ripped. Some of them are in excellent condition. Some of them have a little bit of damage. Here's another beautiful old Valentine's Day card. And here's one with a squirrel on it. I haven't seen Michelle Petty's around. I hope she's well. And here's another one. This is a Valentine's Day card and it has the name on it. And another cute little one. And then you have that one and this one, like I said, some of them, does this one open? Yep. Yeah, this one opens. And it has some writing. It doesn't bring down the value of them. This one doesn't have any writing in it. Whoops. There's that one. I love this one. It's beautiful, but it is ripped on the side. See the roses, but look at how beautiful that is. <clears throat> There's this one and this one. That is awesome. Made in the USA. With love. That's a beautiful one. And then there's a notepad, turquoise, whatever company this is. And here's another just sticky note notepad. This is just assorted ephemera now. Um, handling freight your way. Here is a little Southwest National Bank, Wichita, Kansas. It's just a little, um, little book. Here is another Armors Big Crop Fertilizing. Again, just another book. And the year on it is 1951. Here's another note card. Cut the red tape. Customer Service Center. Here's another fertilizer company. 
And again, it's a note card, it's a notebook. And this is just a memorial. It was in there. These are, this is really awesome here, you guys. This is, this stuff here is, I got to show you this. This is beautiful. These are, um, and I think that most of them have their envelopes. I took a quick peek. They are uh, silk screened by hand by Masakwaki Indian Settlement. And I'll show you the image. There it is. Wood carvers. So I'm not going to open each one. Um, there's one in here. There's another one in here. These are all silk screened and they come with the envelopes, but you got to see how beautiful. Can you see how gorgeous they are? Um, let me get a close up. Yeah. So, um, and like I said, they have the envelopes with them. Here's another one. Here's another one. Anything that's Indian is really, really sought after. There's this one. Here's another one. Making the mat of rushes. These are beautiful. These little cards are really, truly beautiful. Um, and this one. Okay, and then the ones that I didn't open. And then we're back to some more old advertisements. Um, another advertisement. This is just an old flower card. This is road rated shackles. Another advertisement. Here is a perfect spelling certificate. 1971. Here's an old Christmas card. Here's a old Valentine's Day card another valentine's day card here is a story of the states montana oregon the lincoln welding guide um sing along the way um so it's a music it's a little music book here's another beautiful valentine's day card and on the back of it it is written in pencil on the back of that here is a mother goose rhymes and this one looks like just this one little booklet was ten dollars and here is wishing you the merriest of christmas and signatures of parents certificate of promotion the certificate oh so this is um like a they got promoted to the next grade, perhaps. And here is a souvenir postcard collection, 12 postcards printed from original oil paintings by Craig Boone. Um, I'll just open them up real quick and show you. So they are just beautiful wildlife scenes. Thank you, Secret Agent. Josh, I, I'm coming with you, Josh. <laughs> Pick me up. <laughs> Where is he going? Casino. Oh. In Connecticut. You, you like to ga 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 uh, gamble? Donna, I'm a reseller. I buy storage units. Right? My dad, my dad used to go to that casino in, is it Connecticut or Rhode Island? The Indian Reservation? Yeah. One? Yeah. There's the place now. We even just we even have one on Long Island now. Is that a United States Air Force uh Navy? Uh I don't know the insignia. There's that one. Hey JJ. There's this one. Now there's a meetup at the casino. <laughs> And then there's these lovely ladies. I don't know, Tony. Better watch out. I've made it to the final table a few times and hold them. And then there's these three little children. 
so cute. And then this beautiful lady here. With that dress and that hair and the bow. Talk about a socialite. Holy cow. Wow. Money, 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 money in this photo. Look at the corset that she's wearing to make her waist thin, thin, thin like that. And then there's this beautiful lady here. And that's the whole lot. All right. Connie's in at 32. Hey, James. Lots of nice assortment of photos in there. Hey, James. Anybody else? Are we going to sell it? Carl comes in at 34. 34 to Carl Buck. Thirty-six to Connie. These are the military ones. Kathy Bowers in the house. Hey, Kathy. Hi, Kathy. Kathy's in at forty. Carl's in at fifty. This is going to be really special. None of these rhymes. These old Valentine's Day cards are so pretty. I wonder if we're going to look at, at today's cut, uh, Valentine's Day cards years from now and say, oh, look at how pretty they were. <laughs> <laughs> right? Kathy's like, oh, out. I knew it was too good to be true. She's still being like, I knew it was too good to be true. Sixty from Carl and Donna. Yes, I, I've got to refresh. All right, so I'm going to leave you for a minute because I keep lagging for some reason. Okay. You keep freezing on me. I don't know why. Okay. She looks like she's a little troublemaker, just saying, with the red hair. Do you know her, Mama G? Mama G? Yeah, that's me. <laughs> Is that you? Yeah. When you were a little girl? Yeah. Look at how beautiful her hair is. <laughs> I love this one, too. Lacing up her ice skates with the big puff. Isn't that adorable? I love that one. It's so cute. This one inside says, the springerly squirrel jumps about and leaps from tree to tree, but I'll be jumping inside out if you'll say yes to me. Aww. To my sweetheart. Say yes. Say yes about what? <laughs> Carl is out. Kathy's at 75. And I think we're going to be sold to Kathy. Kathy, Kathy, Kathy. Lot number 10. Photos and ephemera. to Kathy Bowers for 75. Thank you, Kathy. Thank you so much, my dear. Okay, let me put these away for safekeeping. Okay.
Kathy B. All right, let's put that there. And let's put this here. And this is what I have next. They are Buffalo Nickels. And there's 1936, 1927, 1935, 1937, 1919, 1923, 1935, 1935, 1930, and 1916. That's what I have. Let's give it a $10 start on these. Case included? Nope. Sorry, case is mine. I used to have these cases and I used to sell them, but I can't get them anymore. So when I do have them again, I'll offer them up again, but no. Sure. I was just going to do that, Mrs. Anonymous. I was reading your mind. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten total. Hold on. Okay, there you go. Are there any writing on any of them on the white? Okay, so that's that one. They're all buffalo nickels? Yep. They sure are. There's that one. Donna, I should send you a candle warmer so that way the candle lasts longer. They work so well. I have one. I have a candle warmer. But I love I love the flicker of the light. It it soothes me. Um, I usually use the candle warmer when it gets so far down that you can't really burn the wick anymore. Then I, I use the candle warmer. But thank you. Twenty-two from Little Martin's Est. And there you have it. We got Little Martin's Nest at 22. If there's no other interest, we'll close it. Joanna, what do you think? Thank you, Stephen. You too, sweetheart. Have a good night. Good night, Stephen. Oh, that's interesting. That's awesome, Mrs. Anonymous. Oh, interesting. Let me know if you guys want to see them up close again. Oh, see, like that one was what Josh asked. See, one of them says VG. He asked if any of them said that. This one says VG? No, the one next to it. That one says VG? Yeah. What does that mean? Very good. They're graded. Oh.
There's the 1930. Look at the nose on that guy. <laughs> Holy cow. Hey, Donna Shriver. Donna's in 34. Little Martin's Nest is in a 36. I don't know anything about these coins. Like, what? what's the deal with the coins? Does anybody know? They're like, buffalo nickels. It was before the regular nickel. They made buffalo nickels. Oh, yeah? American Indian, yeah. Based on the American Indian tribes. It's a 1937. Yeah, my mom was born. Little Martin's Nest is out. Donna's in at 38. They were made from 1917 to 1938. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. See, a lot of them have VG on them. Yeah, VF. What does VF mean? Very fine, I guess. That one just says G. Good. What's F? I guess fine. I don't know. You sure? What's EF? What's EF mean? Excellent, fine. E extra fine? I don't know. Extra fine, baby. Extra fine, maybe? I don't know. But they've got some stuff. Donna Shriver's at 38. We're going to sell it to Donna. And Boston's barking. I'm sorry, guys. Lot number 11 is the coins. And it's going to very fine, extra fine. Oh, okay. Boston. Donna Shriver. Hey, Chris. Hi, Chris. Good to see you. Coins. Goose. I'll show him really quick before you close it. Because he just came in. Buffalo nickel coins. Cindy says, my husband is a collector. Well, Cindy, you oh. should be buying your, your husband. Sorry, I'm spending your money, Cindy. I'll take my hands out of your back pocket. <laughs> I hate now to Robert Williams. I hate when people put their hands in my back pocket <laughs> and tell me what I should do and what I shouldn't do with my money. You did, Chris? Wow, how cool. So what did you do? You bought like a roll of, of of nickels and when you opened it up, it was all these kind of nickels? Wow, that's interesting. Donna's in for 42 now. Thank you, Donna. Let me know if anybody wants to see any more up close. Yep, I used to go coin hunting back in the day, he says. Oh, that is so cool. I know somebody else who does that. Jenea does that. Oh, she, yeah? Yeah, she buys... Um, what does she buy? She'll ask for rolls of... Is it quarters that come in silver, too? They Just can, one? yes. Yeah? She'll, she'll ask for, like, two rolls of quarters when she goes to the bank. And then she'll go through them and see if she can find any silver quarters. Or do, do I don't know, do, do they roll half dollars? I don't think so, right? I don't know. 
or maybe she'll ask for half dollars. I can't remember what the story is, sorry. I found a whole bunch of half dollars and dollar coins and other coins that were stolen from the apartment during a showing or after they left the apartment door open. I had a whole bunch of, oh, no way. Oh, it's easier. Maybe it's half dollars is what she asks for. Yeah. Hey, Karen. Yeah, I think it's half dollars is what she asks for. I mean, for. quarters can be. You can find silver quarters. Is that JJ and Goose? Yeah. Are both yeah. Here? JJ's yeah. been born, yeah. Hey, JJ. All right, Tony's in for 50. Anyone else? Let us know. Donna's out. The house I used to live in growing up as an old butcher shop, and I used to find coins from the 1800s. Oh, how cool. Oh, half dollars or silver. Yeah. That's so she. I guess she asks for half dollars, and she hunts for silver ones. Pretty cool hobby. Silver dollars and ha half dollars are very popular. Hi, Amy. Tony, $50. Thank you, Tony. All right, we are sold, sold, sold. They do not roll half dollars because people buy boxes of them and they do lives on YouTube and opening. They find silver ones in there. So they do a half dollar ones. Oh. Huh. See, there's a whole other like YouTube market we don't even know about. Right. That'd be interesting to watch. Did I do three? Are you up? I did the plush lot, the photos, and the coins. You're up, honey. Okay. Thanks, guys. Thanks, Tony. All right, let me do um, let me do these first. Let's grab. Them. All right, it's a box of carded. Well, some of them are carded, some are, of them aren't. They're just a bunch of cars. This one is kind of cut up a little bit. This one's in a little case. These are larger scale, scale cars and trucks. $20, Amy. Lost my chat again. Hold on. to guys. What are these monster guys? Mm. 
This looks like just a construction guy. This one looks like it might be missing something here. Maybe a ladder. I don't know. Actually, it's missing a wheel now that I look at it. All right. Well, we'll throw it in anyway. I don't know if it's of any, any, any good to anybody. But, yeah, see, this one's missing a wheel, too. It's a mini one with Snoopy in it. There's a carded one in here, but it fell off the card. That's what happens when this glue gets... I mean, I'll, get, I'll include the cards in case you can put it back again, but... It's a Hot Wheel. Oh, it says Easter exclusives. Oh, just in time. Just in time. This is Mickey. It's a metal truck with Mickey on it. I guess it's a Hot Wheel or let's see. It's a Matchbox Disney series, Walt Disney Productions, 1979 Lesney. Here's another Mickey on a fire truck. This is a car, but I just realized it's a Transformer. <laughs> I just realized it's a transformer. But somebody threw it in there, so we're going to include it. We're going to include it for sure. I don't know. It's a back to something. Trailer. Car trailer. Looks like the south of the border guy. You know, this car has a, has a key. Yeah, so what I thought was going to be large is a kind of a mishmash, just a bunch of stuff thrown in here. Hey, Frank. The metal one. It's an Ertle. It's an Ertle. It's a John Deere. It's a John Deere Ertle. It's a McDonald's race car. It's a Getty. Oh, look, it's Frank's Getty station, Frank. <laughs> The tow truck. All right, are we done and done? Done and done and done? Something in a plastic bag in here. Let's see. I'm going to call it the casual clipper. There's a Tootsie or something else in here. 
is just a bag and what looks to be a couple of oh wait here my tray. I like when I can show you guys on a tray. It's frustrating. All right, so I'll count them. So you got one, two, three. Got Josh at 44. All right, anybody else? Five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Hey, Wendy. Hey, Mark. Okay, doesn't want to stay there. We're going to call it. We're going to call it. We're going to call it. Casual is out. All right. Let's call it to Josh. Thank you, Josh. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, my desk is a complete mess. <laughs> All right, we're going to be looking at this for the first time. I know it has something to do with sewing. I have no idea what's in here. It says Singer on here. It says Singer Sew so Essentials. And I didn't even open it. God knows if I even can open it at this point. So I don't know how to do it. All right. There's a box of thread, that's for sure. I'm going to sell the case and all. And whatever's in the bag, as long as it pertains to sewing, I don't think you want that anyway. Um, no, there's nothing in here that pertains to sewing. It's nothing, honestly. It's How much do you want to start this at? I don't know. 20 bucks, I guess. Are there reels not supposed to go on? Yes, they are supposed to go on like that. All right, so I'll tell you how many spools of thread you have. So you have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 of the larger spools of thread on here. Multicolors. There are case of push pins no pin cushion needles pin cushion needles regular eye needles there's <laughs> one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve of these in different colors pink green turquoise there's a bunch of bobbins there's about a dozen or so of bobbins. You've got these pins. 
some safety pins, some ribbon. I don't know if this is a needle. Oh, this is to remove thread, right? Thread remover. It looks like there might be some sewing machine needles. They look awful big. And then I think these are to thread a needle. Not 100% sure. Anybody know? Thread a needle? I don't sew either. I don't sew. I don't cook. <laughs> I buy storage units. And this is what I bring you guys. <laughs> And then there's some, it looks like to be some hook and loop stuff in here or something. And you get the Singer case. So that's what you get. I'm surprised Junebug isn't all over this. <laughs> she probably has so much. Hey, Mark. Welcome in. What are you eating? Mm, Swiss cheese. That's awesome. Yeah. It's so cute. It is so cute, right? And it's got all your sewing needs in. <laughs> that is adorable. Yeah. I love that. Can you show it again? Lindsay wants to know, T. I'm sorry? Can you oh, show can it again? Yeah, sure. Absolutely. Okay. So that's the sides of it. And then it opens up at the top here. The handle down. Pop it open. And you've got all these pop-out compartments here that you can store things in. There are some stuff in here now. There's needles. There's pin cushions. There's bobbins. Um, you've got some nice stuff to, to start you off. Definitely have some nice stuff to start you off. June bugs at 40. Oh, there she is, June bug. I figured you had enough of this stuff. <laughs> I just said June bug. I'm surprised you're not all over. Right. I just she started you bidding as soon as you said that. No, oh, really? Mm hmm That's funny. It's it's so cool. Cool. Thank you, Mark. Mary Ness out. Siggy's out. Amy's out. All right, we're going to call it to June at 40. I stepped away. I need that case. <laughs> All right, June, it's yours, baby. 40 bucks to June. All right. Thank you, Jim Book. All right, let's do this little lot of books I have sitting here. Let's see if anybody's interested. Let's start this off at 10 bucks. It's just a small lot of books that I have. I'll bring more books over the weekend or definitely next week. Um, Nancy Drew, The Invisible Intruder, Skater Farm. Diary of a Wimpy Kid, Madeline, Lizzie McGuire Mysteries, Ghost Town at Sundown, Judy Bloom Double Fudge, Snow Day from the Black Lagoon, More from the Molsons, Dinosaurs Before Dark, Time Warp Trio, 
The Case of the Bicycle Bandit, The Mystery in Venice, The Boxcar Children, Martha on the Case, Ramona and Her Father. Well, the other one that I have sitting here wasn't even going to include, but I'm going to just throw it in. I'm just going to throw it in. It's kind of in rough shape, but it is it is a nice book because it does have like a lot of um, where in the world are they now kind of, but it is detached, so it's not in the best condition, but I'm going to include it anyway for you guys. All right. And if Iris wants it, let's sell it to Iris for 10 bucks. Oops. I wonder how um, Susan's doing tonight. Susan Arrington. Yeah, we haven't seen her in tonight. Little Martin's Nest is going to come in for 12. Iris is in for 14. Tomorrow? What's that? Do we have any food for tomorrow? Daddy just went to Costco. We should have food. Should we make sandwiches and stuff? Can you make sandwiches? I'm still working. You're driving me tomorrow morning, right? What? You're driving me tomorrow morning, right? Yeah, we have to be there at what time? 8.30. 8.30 we have to be there? Okay. Do we have to go to Dunkin' Donuts before we go? Uh. Okay. <laughs> All right, we're going to sell it to Iris at 14. <laughs> Thank you, Iris. Hey, Fancy Nancy. Did she just ask you for food? Are you kidding me? It's normal. She asked me for food for tomorrow for the beach. If I was going to make sandwiches, I asked her to make them. Okay, you guys ready? I have an awesome stack of postcards. Um, I don't know if I'm going to show you all of them because there's a lot here, but man, I'll tell you what, this reminds me of home. That's like where I was born right there. It says courtyard showing Jacobson door from a close exact. I don't know where it is, but it looks like home. Donna, I need sandwiches, right? Mark. Okay, so um, what do you want to start these out at? Let's start it at 25, see where it goes. Here's another beautiful one. Um, let's see, Worth Series Express. I'm not sure. It's not written on in the back. Here's another beautiful one. Look at that. Really, really beautiful. Love it. The old castle. And okay, so I'm not going to take forever to show these, but just gives you an idea. This is Long Beach, California. Look at, look at, look at, look at the car. Wow. Look at how awesome that is. Nice. Isn't that a great postcard? One cent, right? 1945. Love it. Okay, here's an upside down one. Okay, sorry. <laughs> This is a beautiful, elegant restaurant. Where is it? Santa Maria in Santa Maria, California. And it has a stamp on it, but it was never sent, never canceled. Here's another one. Oops, this way. Another California and pea piece. soup restaurant. Huh. 1958. Okay. You guys know how I feel about postcards, so I don't want to take forever, but look at that garden. And this one's 1921. Wow. 
Yeah, really beautiful. So this whole stack is really amazing. Here we have Monterey Bay in California. And this one is postmark 1951. Here we have Hotel Maryland, Pasadena. Nineteen eleven. That's what year my house was built up in um, Boston. Look at this dude. Wait, that's a man, right? Yeah. All right. The Devil's Golf Course. One cent. So, what did you say it was? T the, the one cent stamps were. Hey, look at this is Donner. <laughs> it's the Donner bread, you guys. That's so funny. Uh, Catalina, Catalina Island, California. This one's beautiful. Look at this one. Ooh, I love the umbrellas on this one. Los Angeles. 1952, two cent stamp. It's another really pretty one, Los Angeles. Another pretty one, Los Angeles. Awesome. These are so awesome. They feel like the, the um, almost like linen. 1944. Look at the cursive writing, how gorgeous it is. Look at her cursive writing. Oh my God, it's so beautiful. Here we have this one, Los Angeles again, dearest sister. And then she said, forget it. I'm not writing to you. You're not worth it. No, I don't know what happened. Um, one cent. Carl said they are linen, he believes. They're, they feel like linen. Yes, they feel like linen, Carl. They're so beautiful. Holy smokes. These are so gorgeous. What a treasure. Okay, and then another one of that one and another one of this one and this one. 1941. Love them. Okay, I'll go quick. I don't want to bore you guys. I know some of you don't like looking at pictures and postcards. Tucson, Arizona. Where's Ronnie G? Ronnie G, is this your backyard? That's beautiful. Are those lemon trees? Oh, grapefruit. Arizona Groves, 1954. So yeah, this whole stack is just amazing. What was that? Oh, that's a veterans hospital, you guys. That's 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 really cool. US Veterans Hospital. Um one cent stamp. So I'd be really interested to see what this guy says. I wonder if he was there because of the war. All right, I'm not gonna read it. I won't bore you. I should do a video. I always say I'm going to do a video and then I never do. Oh my gosh. Look at this one. You guys, this is awesome. Mexico, maybe. Oh, wait. Yeah. Mexico. <laughs> I know my dresses. <laughs> Let's see what this one is. Another veterans hospital. Oh, it's the same one. Just a different shot. I wonder if it still looks like that. Arizona, Phoenix, Arizona. Look at how pretty. I want to look at this with the lens. That is really pretty. Look at those shrubs. That's really pretty. I wonder what these are made out of. Like, like I don't know. They're like, they don't feel like, I don't know if they're printed. I, I just don't know what they are. No, I don't know anything about, I don't, I know nothing, nothing, nothing about postcards. Nothing. Absolutely zero. 
squirrel. <laughs> white tail squirrel. The white tail squirrel. Oh, look at this one. Daddy, love you, Bobby. How cute is that? That's adorable. Ooh, look at this one. Is that a, a bison? Oh, it's a buffalo. Phoenix, Arizona. Donkeys. Love the donkeys. Some sort of gecko. Cowboys and Indians. Ride 'em cowboy. Some of them, have, some of them have not are not written on 1945. Some of them are. Okay, am I boring everybody? Should I go faster? Um, where are we at? Do we have bids? Oh, okay. 85 with Nancy. All right, thank you. They're beautiful. Look at those cactus flowers. Is that what they are? Night blooming something. Um, it's a one cent stamp on it. 1927. 1927. Ooh, look at this one. Oh, look at this, you guys. They typed it. They put this in a typewriter. Dearest mother and yeah. This is the best picture I have seen of how the cactus look in bloom. We are all okay, but business is terrible. We still eat, but we have to get some change of luck soon. Love you, Lillian and Willie. Oh, 1930. B business was terrible. I wonder what kind of business... That was sad. That made me sad. It was a cobbler. What? It was a cobbler. How do you know? I just have this feeling. It came over me. He was a cobbler. Oh, he, <laughs> <on ships. laughs> he was a cobbler? Yes, they work on shoes. All right, Josh. Lots of luck. Win millions so you can bring it back to the auction. <laughs> Josh, have fun, honey. Oh my gosh, look at how small that writing is. Spent the day at the cab in 1949. Desert Road, Arizona. Oh my gosh. Okay. All right, I'll go fast. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna show the backs. I'm not gonna read them because then I get caught up reading them. And I'm gonna go through the whole lot. Twilight at the desert. Okay, so we'll just sit here for a second at going twice. All right, 29, Josh. 29. Number 29. Morning on the desert. Oh, I should I should take a photo of this and send it to Ronnie G. Wonder if she's ever heard this before. Hold on. Okay, done. Okay. Oh, this one's interesting. 1905. Wow. <laughs> 1905, you guys. That's an oldie. From Cal Greetings from California. 1905. Holy cow. Stanford University. That's an old, this is an old one, 1905 as well. 1905. Stanford again. Okay, I'll go fast. Oh, I just have to show you the writing on this one. Look at this. Look at that, you guys. Is that amazing? That was done with nine. That's nineteen eleven, maybe. That was definitely nineteen eleven. That was definitely done with a, a um, is it a fountain pen? Yeah, it looks like it could be. Yeah, with a, a fountain pen one. 
There's that one. There's that one. This one. Where's this? Catalina Islands. Is that one? Oh, Ooh, look at this one with the old car. Redwood Highway, California. Giant Redwood Stump. <laughs> Are they laughing at me? No, Nancy's singing in the chat. Is she going that? Oh, last one. To the Hulto, California. Little city. Oh, they're all like bored. Sorry. Nancy, it's such a lovely place. They're okay. singing Hotel California. Oh, they're singing Hotel California. Yeah. Oh, okay. I thought they would. This one, 1936. Awesome, Josh. Oh, Kyle came in at 90. Carl came in at 90. I don't know about Kyle. Wow. Look at the That's size. what I meant. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I said. I was like, what? What did I do? <laughs> you know my address. <laughs> beautiful. Look at that beautiful dining room. All right, I'm going to go fast. That's beautiful. These are amazing. These are some of the most amazing um, cards I've ever gotten. Rose oh, my gosh. Kingdom. Thank you, guys. Now the song's in my head. Right? <laughs> Japanese Tea Garden, Pacific Grove, California, 1915. Look at Love these old cards. I wish you all a happy new year. We are all well, hoping the same from you. With love to you and all your family. Anna. So amazing. So amazing. Ooh, look at this one. It's a birthday greeting. It's all embossed. Can you see it? It's one cent. I can't, 1915, it looks like. Oh, right there, 1915, yeah. And it's all, like, in, like this is all embossed. It's a beautiful card. Oh, look at this one. Same thing. It's all, can you see it? It's all raised. Oh, there's a number 11 on it. Hi, Denali. There's a number 11 on it. For no reason. Just a number 11. Oh. Look at, it's got like, it's like they wrote something and then they put like a sticker on top of it and maybe reused it. I don't know, 1913, but you see how it's got a sticker on top of it? All right, I'll go fast. January 1st, 1907. Look at how eloquent that is. I don't know what's prettier, the front or the back, right? So gorgeous. Here's another one that's embossed and another one. This one is embossed. New Year greetings. It's not written on. This one is embossed, but this one is written on. 1903. Wrap your head around that for a minute. 1903. It's amazing. Love this one. Look at how cute. Nineteen thirteen. Okay. This is a nice lot. Turkey. Nineteen oh nine. Mark says he's still feeling for that poor cobbler. Oh God, me too. This one looks like a more of an updated penmanship, doesn't it? But it's got a one cent stamp. All right. You want the rest of them to be surprise ones? This is how many is left, so I don't bore everybody else. Should I include them? <laughs> <you in? laughs> this is how many are left. If you want me to show them, I will, but this is what's left.
St. George Church near London. All right, Nancy's in for a hundred. Colorado. Ooh, look at this one looks spooky. Santa Barbara. Hey, Ro Robert Johnson, AKA Connie Johnson. <laughs> How do we know? I don't know. It's kind of like, really? Do we really want to doubt it? I don't know. Connie Johnson, if that's really you. What did you send Donna what? today? Yeah. And who did you look like? Oh, God. Can you imagine? Like, look at that carpeting and look at those chairs. Like, who was their decorator? Who was their freaking interior decorator? Holy cow. They need fired. Yes. They need to be fired. Period. Like, no questions asked. They need to be. This, you know, you know who decorated this room? That couple. That business is bad. Yeah, that's why business is bad. Exactly. <laughs> Business is bad because they decorated this room. They got to stop decorating like that. Business is never going to get good, ever. <laughs> ever, ever, ever. It's always going to stay bad. <laughs> that, looks like, that looks like Cape Cod. Do I not know my area? This is my home. Wait, is... is um. Oh God! Province, Provincetown. It's 1961, but yeah, I knew it. Didn't I call it? I said that looks like Cape Cod. The heck is going on here? Bunch of farm <laughs> Connecticut. I love Cape Cod too. That's a beautiful one. Oh, it's Monte Carlo. Oh, how cool. Let's look at this one up close. Oh, no way. That is so neat. Look at the way they're dressed. Look at the way they would go out to stroll around. Isn't that amazing? Love it. It doesn't have... Um, it doesn't have a year on it. Hi, Rob. All right. You guys want me to stop? We want to know if Carl's still in. Did we get an out from Carl? Yeah. Oh. Carl fell asleep. Carl. Wake up, Carl. <laughs> oh, my gosh. This is so beautiful. Look at that. Where is that? Inner Courtyard, Exeter Cathedral, Cove. Wake up, Carl. Carl's in the one town. <laughs> Catalina, Catalina Postale. Awesome, Connie. 125 now from Nancy. Firenze. Firenze. I mm. tell you when you did that, I nearly peed my pants. Call <laughs> them. Nancy's in for one twenty-five. All right. All right. That's like juice. I have more of these. I'm gonna do a video, and so the people that are interested in it can watch it, so I don't bore people. Tunnel via Male. Huh. I wonder where that is. No, Brian, you do not. Oh, my God, Brian, aren't these awesome? Well, I've got Connie asking, what was that picture? Which one? Oh, this one? It's a Memorial Hall Museum, Deerfield, Massachusetts. I don't know. It looks like a wood door to me. That's what it looks like to me, too. I have no idea. 
Strange to me now are the forms I meet when I visit the dear old town, but the native air is pure and sweet, and the trees that overshadow each will be known street as they balance up and down and singing you whispering stills. I don't know. Who's this dude? Who is that? This is... And we're going to be sold. Pioneer Village. He must be the owner or something. I don't know. Okay, I'm all done. I'm done and done. Congrats, Nancy. Nancy, thank you. Oh, this is beautiful, too. Good night, secret agent. Good night, secret agent. Oh, look at the old wood, wood mill. Oh, look at this, T. Catskills. Oh, yeah. Catskills Game Farm, yeah. Do you know it? Yeah. Do you? Does it still look like that? I don't even know if it still exists, to be honest with you. It's been years. And some old bridge. Okay. All right. I'm done. Sorry. <clears throat> what, Brian? What? What? What's, I might need a truck for tomorrow, T. I got a call tonight about buying some dealer, some dealers tomorrow. I know it's it's hard, Brian. I I had my I had the woman who um I buy my estate stuff. Send me some pictures today, and, and I declined. And it's the first time I've declined. So this is lot number twelve, and it's going to Nancy. Yes. Nancy for one twenty-five. Yes. Um, postcards. It's the first time I've ever declined. I don't like to decline because she always brings me really great stuff. But I just declined on something too. I had to. Yeah. Got to know when to say enough is enough. Okay. All right. So that's going to Nancy's house. And am I still up? I feel like I took so long. That's all you did was postcards, honey. I know, but I took forever to do it. Well, do something else. Okay. So, so I had brought this with me last weekend when I went away. I sold all the makeup that I had here. I, I have more, but... This is going to be a mystery. I'll show you some things in it. Um, you get this um, cosmetic case. And in here is a whole bunch of that shelf pull stuff. I'm going to start. I'm just going to start the bidding on this at $5. Um, and I'm just going to show you some of the things that are in here. Um, for anybody who didn't get a chance to bid the other night on... Um, the big lot. I thought I would bring this in as like a, you know, a small item, but it's full. It's full of shelf pull um, cosmetics. All right, Mimi Resells is going to start us off. So for you ladies that know how much cosmetics cost, this is a great deal. It even has a brand new chapstick that's never been taken out of the package. There's a pair of tweezers in here. There's a nail file in here. Um, there's some sort of masks in here. So yeah, so that's what it is. It's just a cosmetic bag full of cosmetics. It looks kind of funny with Robert saying, oh, I love Clinique. <laughs> Robert. <laughs> Just the bag alone is really pretty. What? Oh, you think you'll see Katie there? No. And I'm going to go get, oh, 5,000 magazines. Mr. Buys a lot. Oh, my goodness gracious. Yeah. All right, Connie's in for 11. Oh, Lindsay's out. All right, let's sell it for $11. Just a little treat. Did we get it now from Mimi? I don't know. Mimi resells. Let us know. We need 13 if you're in, honey. 13 from MJ. Thank you. you guys refresh. refresh if you're um, lagging. Robert, we need 15.
Ha ha, Connie, I'm teasing. <laughs> Connie's in for 15. Thank you, Connie. Thank you, Robert. I think the pink was going to look so pretty on you. Connie's out. Mimi's Connie. out. MJ, let us know. 17 is the next bid. It's a great deal. That's like the cost of like one eyeshadow in the store. And it's it's full. It is full, full, full. All new cosmetics. 17 from MJ. 19 is the next bid. 19 from Connie. Just the tweezers alone. Right? Right? The tweezers alone are so expensive. Connie, we need 21, sweetheart. Connie Johnson. We already have Connie books and things in for 19. MJ is out. Okay. We got the two Connies. Connie Johnson, if you're in, we need two. All right. She's going to come in for 23. All right. Thank you, Connie. Connie books and things. The next bid is 25. 25 from Jazzy Pants. Thank you, Jazzy Pants. Mary Ness, we need 27. We have Jazzy Pants in for 25. Connie is out. I'll be right back. Connie Johnson's in for 27. Mary Ness is out. Jazzy Pants, let us know. 29 is the next bid. All right, I'm going to add. Jazzy Pants is in for 30. I'm going to add this. It's Monster High. Sorry, I didn't even realize it was Monster High. That should go with the kids. I have a kid's lot that I put all kids' things in. But I'll put it in. Maybe you know a kid. Or maybe, maybe you like to wear Monster High nails. Who knows, right? I'm going to put this in. I'm going to put this in. I'm going to put this in. This is really and actually a really pretty pretty color on nails. I'm going to put that in. I'm going to put that in. I'm going to put this in. And I'm going to put this in. And this. And that's all I can fit in there. All right. And we have Robert, a.k.a. Connie, in at 35. Nice big bunch of stuff. Sorry. Do you have any eye class screws tonight, Donna? <laughs> I don't think oh, I Oh, yeah. Speaking of where, where's Chit tonight? Where's Christopher where's Chit? tonight? Where's, where's Chit? Chit? How about some Tupperware? No, Sorry. I'll have some Tupperware tomorrow night. I'll have some different Tupperware tomorrow night. Is that fancy? Is that the one that was um, the square bottle? Because I've never seen that before. <clears throat> I just got a whole bunch of um, polishes. You guys, I might do a special on polishes too. I don't know. Oh, this one here. Is it set? One oh. apple tree said, sorry, what kind of makeup is in the bag? It's all different kinds. It's all different kinds, honey. There's, um, there's blushes, eyeshadow. There's, you know, polishes. There's a brand new... Um, Oh, sorry. This is a brand new brush. This is nice because it, you know, closes up, keeps it nice and clean. This is exfoliating. There's some sort of Clinique something. Here's another Clinique something. Oh, but I can't open. Yeah, another Clinique product. There's even some makeup remover pads. There's whatever this is. Anyways, it's just a bunch of cosmetics, polishes, and um, tweezers, and 
just stuff. Like all very expensive polish, fancy pink says. Yep, it's just an awesome bag for of like just all cosmetics. All right, Connie's out. We're going to give it to the other Connie. Connie Johnson. All right. And we are sold, 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 sold for $40. That's lot number 13 to Connie Johnson. Awesome. Thank you, Nancy. All right, T, you want to go on? All right. All right, relax, relax, guys, relax. What's the matter? They're all making fun of the Tupperware thing and eyeglasses and I don't know. <laughs> you know how it goes. Yeah. You know how it goes. You know how it goes. Um, I didn't write down the postcards. Was the post? Oh, yes, I did. Okay, never mind. I got it. All right. The next lot is a lot of figures. This is what you get. his head's on backwards. There we go. <coughs> oh, T. It's crazy, you know, it is. <laughs> it looks so nice on you. I didn't even fix my hair. I just was dying with my hair and I grabbed it, it and I said, I'm beautiful. I'll put it on my head. T, I'll send you more colors if you want more. How many did I send you? Any, just the one. Anything with green. Anything with green. That's the only one that has green. Really? T, yeah, T, it looks beautiful on you. I love green. Green's like my favorite color. Jen's like it looks beautiful. Yeah. I didn't even fix my hair. I just threw it on there. <laughs> it looks really, really nice. It looks really, really nice on you. Thank you. I feel like Donna with the postcards. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we can become a cult of rayon scarf. <laughs> Fuzzy, mini, goofy. I should have asked Donna who it was before I said who it was. Right. So we got another, another big guy. Donna, I couldn't manage bikini, but I just put it up here. Can you see it? What is that? A scarf. What did you do? Put put her on. Put her on. It's your channel. Put oh. <laughs> 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 Pretty, you got a green one too? Yeah, same one. 
Yeah. I didn't realize that you got a green one too. That's all the Irish wear is green. It's okay. That's okay. it. We the needed green, it. Yeah, the green looks pretty with your red hair. It looks nice. Thank you. Pretty, pretty. I just wanted to match. Go ahead. Go okay. ahead. Go ahead. All right. All right. All right. This looks like the guy from Bob. It it, it from uh, Blue's Clues. Bob, right? It wasn't that his name? Blue's Clues guy it was Bob. I think that was his name. Oh, um, Gary just texted me. He pushed his time up to nine twenty-five. He oh, must be running late, so we don't. We can, you know, stay on if you want to. I have a couple of more lots I can show for sure. So okay, all right. I mean, I hope he didn't do it on our part. I was certainly willing to get off at nine. No, no, I think he's probably just running late. You know, you know how it is running late. Oh, yes, I do. Well, uh, get my orange juice. My baby. I was talking to Lola. Oh, you're talking to Lola? Sorry. He's a gator bear. Oh, it's Snoopy again. It's Rabbit. <laughs> Bob was the bill. This Steve was the one on the acid trip toy. <laughs> The salt and pepper shaken. All right. Not Lucy, not Lucy, not Schroeder, not Linus. Who is this? Somebody help me. Somebody help me. Patty. Patty, thank you. Yes, Patty. Couldn't think. I'll drop the link when I'm not in the middle of lots, you guys. Who are we dropping? They're asking for Gary's link when I. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll drop. We'll drop it be before we go off. We will. A oh, peppermint patty. That's it. I couldn't think. I could not think. All right, peppermint patty. Two, three, four, five, six. Why did that sound ceramic-y? Oh, I guess that's a ceramic. I didn't even realize it. All right, I'll be careful with that one. <laughs> Seven, eight. I thought they were all like rubber. <laughs> Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 16, 17. Mr. Buys a lot said more, more, more. Fill that box. 19, 20, 21, 22, oops, oops, 23, 24, 25. 
35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52. 52 total. And Deb Forrish is in for 36. How are you doing tonight, Deb? Thanks for coming in. Hey, Carla. 38 from Pam. One for every week, right? Exactly. Pam's in for 38. Looking for 40 now. Rubber ducky, you're the one. Deb's in for 40. The 42. Oh, Jazzy Pants. I don't know. They're all different. This Disney. Um, these should be the whatever whatever Big Hero is, right? Is this Big Hero? I Rescue Hero? One of them, right? Mr. Faisalot says it's a mixed. Yeah, it's definitely a mix. Hey, Justin. Rescue Heroes, right? We should just use the Donald loop. It'll be that much easier. 2001 Mattel. Two thousand and one Mattel on that. She said, never mind. She thought that they were all like the same. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no. I have Pam at 46 now. 2001 Mattel. Yes. That's okay. No problem. Just a whole big box of mixed figures. Some Sesame, some Disney, some Cabbage Patch, some Rescue Heroes. Just a bunch of... And a little bit of this and a little, a little bit, bit of that. And a little bit of that. Fifty now from Deb. Thank you, Deb. No, Nancy, not that one. All right, Pam is going to be out. We're going to call it to Deb. Dale, really? Sold to Deb for 50. Okay. Deb, it's a double congratulations because that lot is on Brian. Mr. Buys a lot. He sent me a, a text and said, I'm paying for the next lot. So congratulations. Brian will be paying nice. for your lot. So double winner, double, double winner. 
You never know when that might happen here on auctions for you. It's happened before. Hmm. All right, Mama G, you ready? Mama G? Yep, maybe. Okay. All right. I'm going to do some dance sweatshirts. I just want to blow these out of here. All right, so okay. guys, I'm doing some dance sweatshirts. Um, 10 bucks. I just want to blow them out of here. So I know this is a You're little bit hold of up one at a time, and I'm going to put sold to the first person. Yeah. When um, they put who the first person is, put the color that they're bidding on. Okay. Sounds good. Thank All you. right, guys, did you hear that? So you're going to tell us what color or size or combination thereof that you are bidding on because it sometimes with the leg, it does make it difficult. I will try to give you guys a full heads up before I show it. And then you guys tell me. <laughs> no, Trish. <laughs> All right, because I just want to get a bunch of these out of here. What All is right. it? What is it? What is it? Some dance sweatshirts. Mm. All right, so this one is looks to be it's a black hooded pullover with pockets, and it's a small, but I'm gonna say it's a junior small, it's not a kid small junior or adult it's it's an adult small they're all gilded heavy blends just so you guys know what they are they're all gilded heavy blends and they're all new and this is a pullover with a hood and it's got the pockets here in the front 10 bucks I thought she is really upset over them sweatshirts. <laughs> Aw, thanks, Brian. Thanks again. That was that was awesome. What did Brian say? No, Brian just paid for the last lot. Oh, he did? That was nice. Who won? Fifty dollars, Deb Forish. All right. If there's no interest, we're going to type pass in the chat and we're going to go to the next one. Okay. What was the fabric mix on the label? Um, I think it's hundred. Uh, no, it's actually, it's 50 cotton, 50 poly, 50, 50, 50, 50 on it. Gildan heavy blends. All right, Mama G, we're going to type pass, I think, in the in the chat. Doesn't look like we have any interest in that one. All right, next one is going to be a, this one is a jerseys. It's a medium. It's 50-50 as well. It's black with stars and dance. And it's an adult medium or junior medium. I don't know. I'll say adult medium. That's what I would say. This is kind of, the dance is kind of more of pink than it's showing white in, in here with the stars. It's kind of like a very light, light pink. Again, it's a pullover and it's a Jersey brand 50, 50 size medium. Ten dollars. Donna? Yes. MJ is just making a comment about her invoice. <clears throat> oh. Okay. I don't know what it was. What did what did you what did you buy, MJ? All right, no interest. We're gonna pass on that one too. 
Thank you, MJ. I, I don't know what you bought, so. All right, the next one is a Gildan. It is another adult small. It's a gray with a colored, multi rainbow colored dance. Gildan 50 50 heavy blends. She said a Star Trek plate. Oh, okay. I got it. I have it here. I didn't ship it out yet. Yeah, Star Trek plate. Thank you. All right, looks like nobody's interested in any of these sweatshirts. What if we do them as a lot? For resale. Thank you, Brian. Thank you, thank you. Nobody wants any sweatshirts? All right, let's do it as a lot then. All right, so we'll do one. The two I threw over there is three. Here's another one. This is a size small. It's four. $20 ship to start. This one is a small. The sizes are small to medium in kid sizes and young adult sizes. Right. Yeah, this is a kid size. This next one is a medium kids. If dance were any Easter easier, <laughs> it would be football. How many pieces? Uh, right now we're up to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There's going to be about 10 pieces, I think. All right. 10 pieces with the $20 start, you guys. That's phenomenal. This is a medium. This has got the dance logo on the back and the front here. Yeah, I like this one. That's awesome. And it actually, there's two of those. And this one is also a medium as well. Connie comes in at 20. You guys think of gift giving too. If, you, if you're not going to resell them, they'd make awesome Easter gifts or Christmas Sweet. presents, birthday presents. You got one, two, three. And Shelly's in at 30. Five. Six. I got to go pick up the two I threw across the room. <laughs> or three I threw across the room. Three. All right. There'll be 10 total. There's 10 total. All right, Connie's Books and Things is in at 36. All right, this is the one from, that makes seven. This makes eight. This is 38, Shelly. Forty to Connie. And this is 10. That's awesome. Ten pieces, and this actually, this one is an extra large. This one is an extra large. Not too many of the big sizes left, but most dancers aren't big. <laughs> right. So remember that. So yeah, this is an adult extra large. I didn't realize you had an extra large left. 
All right, you've got Connie at 40. What do you think, Shelly? 42 is the next bid. If not, we're going to call it down. I think Shelly's the only one left bidding. Shelly, either type in out. Yeah, they do, Susan. All right, there you go. And they gild in heavy blend most of them. I mean, there's a couple of one or two that are Jersey, but they're still good even with that name. Donna Shriver sneaks in at 42. Thank you, Donna. Thank you, Connie. Thank you, Shelly. Appreciate Shelly it. No. Shelly and Connie. 44 to Connie. Thank you, Connie. Shelly, what happened to you? Either out or the next size. They're mostly um, medium, and there's one extra large. So there's uh, like mostly eight or nine of them are adults, or what I would consider some juniors, not necessarily like small. There's one medium kids. The rest are juniors, adults, small, medium, and at one extra large. Right. Donna's at 46. Okay. Thank you, Donna. Connie's out, calling it down to Donna. All right. No, do you want to offer um, the bidders the same lot for that price? I could. If anybody's interested, I could give I could put another lot together at 46 if somebody wants it. For sure. Honey, Shelly, you guys interested in 46? I'm giving T's things away for her again. <laughs> I can I can put 10 together like that for sure. Okay. Connie, let us know. Shelly, let us know. If you would like a lot. It'd be 10 sweatshirts. All mixed. I mean, that's a great deal for 10 sweatshirts. I mean, oh my God, no. <laughs> hey, Moni Love. Moni they're, um, they're 10 sweatshirts. They're branded dance. There's some kids. There's some adults. It's all it's all random. Um, get 10 pieces. 10 pieces, folks, for $46. Write me in the chat if you want a bundle. You know, you get a you get a variety of sizes, a variety of colors. Yes, they do, Joanne. Mm, it's 10 for 46. <clears throat> it's a great deal. It honestly is a great deal. All right. And it looks like we're done and done. All right. So just one to Donna. No, no Shelly, no Connie, nobody else. Okay. Thank you, Donna. Are you ready, Missy? Yeah. Okay. I'll show one more lot. Okay. I have some Barbie dolls. Um, I'm not going to look at the years in the back because it will take too long. This one, somebody cut her hair. But don't be afraid to list this one, even if it's old, because um, people restore them. It says $19.99 on the back of it. Okay, Pam, you got it, honey. Thank you. But someone cut her hair. Pam, um, do I owe you a pair of yoga pants? I have yoga pants down for just Pam, and I'm not sure what Pam bought them. Was it you, honey? Can you let me know? 
Messy hair, I don't care. So these are the dolls. So you get one, two, three, four, five dolls. And then... No, it wasn't you either. Okay, thank you. One dude. And look at the look on his face. He's like, yeah, baby. I'm with all these beautiful chicks, right? So you get all that. Look at the look on his face. So you get all those for dolls. And then you get this whole bucket of Barbie clothes. And I'm just going to show you some just to give you an idea of the Barbie clothes that are in here. This looks like um, Beauty and the Beast, the Beauty and the Beast outfit. What are you starting this lot at? Um, 25. Ken has changed. Yeah, I don't think that's Ken. No, he's somebody from Scooby-Doo, isn't he? I don't know. I don't know where he's from. He looks familiar. I think he's from... Oh, Hans from Frozen. That's it, Saxton Cole. Oh, Donna never saw Frozen. I never saw Frozen. Donna, we're going to watch Frozen in the green room one day. As a matter of fact, Mama G... Yeah, like you, I got time. We're going we're gonna to do it with... Um, Juju, you have to be registered, hun. So if we, we'll drop the link, if you'd like to register, then we'll go ahead and allow you to bid. Thank you for coming in. Cloudy with a Chance of Meatballs. I actually have that movie. I'm going to watch it for the first time ever. Juju, there you go, hon. Karen's in for 25. And then this is, must be a Barbie. It's pillow. A, it says Barbie. It says Mattel Barbie on it. If that's a pillow, maybe. And or then, sham. Or this is the pillow. And this is maybe the blanket. But the whole set yes. is here. This looks like it's homemade, but it was in with the clothes. So, and there's a Barbie hat, an apron, another little skirt. It's on my bucket list, Fancy Nancy. I More pants, another skirt, and another shirt. I think think that this is a Barbie radio. I'm not 100% sure. It was with the Barbies. And then there's some there's some smaller pieces like little tops and don't know what this is, but it was all in with the Barbie stuff. Um And then there's um some I believe to be Barbie brushes there's a whole bunch of barbie brushes in there <clears throat> all right so that's what you get you get all those clothes and you got all these barbies and that's one lot and that's all of it and we have one bid for $25. We have Karen in for $25. Anyone else? Um, who's in for $25? Karen's at the beach. Oh, Karen's at the beach. Shelly comes in. Hey, Shannon Perez. Shelly Tarbett's in for $27. It's Kristoff from Frozen. A lot of them are like the Disney 
princess dresses that are in this lot. So I don't know if there's any value, but there you have it. 29 from Karen, 31 from Shelly. Thank you, Shelly. Thank you, Karen. Karen's at 33. Thank you, Karen. And I'm going to drop Gary's link. Don't yeah. worry, guys. Yeah, yeah, please. Yeah, guys, don't forget, Westside Gary and the Treasure Hustlers are coming on immediately following this. Please go over and support them. Tell them T and Donna and Mama G sent, sent you guys. 37 now from Karen. Shelly's at 39. And big shout out. Thank you again to Brian for paying for that awesome food lot that Miss Deb Forish won. Congrats again, Deb. You're going to get this one too. Teresa, without the H. Um, the box is all broken, so um, I probably will take her out of the box and ship her with the rest of the Barbies. This isn't the one I was looking for. There was another one that I wanted to give you. I just had my hands on it. Oh, I never sold those towels. Um, Where is it? I can't find it. Okay. Shelly's back in at 43. She's like, wait, what? Uh-huh. <laughs> there was another one. 45 from Karen. Hold on a second. Hold on, folks. Hold She's on. Oh, wait. The There's more. 47 from Shelly. Let me see if I can find her. I just hey, Shelly, just change your mind. It's a woman's prerogative. It's all good. All good. Just had my hands on her. <clears throat> Karen's in for 49 now. What the heck did I do with her? Oh, I found her. I found her. I found her. And you get this one as well. Oh, Shelly sneaks in at 54. Look at that Ex exciting move. 1989, you guys. 1989 on the bride. 1989. So that's an awesome lot. You get the Swan Lake, the bride, but no box, just, you know. And then... The bucket o Barbies with all those clothes. So that's a pretty awesome lot, if I do have to say so myself. Donna, want to sell Miss Johnson an awesome, amazing album lot? <laughs> Another one? I would love to. All right, we're going to be sold to Karen at 59. Up, oh, picky Nikki swoops picky in Nikki. before we, we sell it. Woohoo! Look at that move. Everybody's getting moved in here. Right? This one looks old, doesn't it? What did what year did I say on it? Even the face on her looks older. You so, said 89, I think. Yeah, look at her. Joy Monkin. Joy, you know the rules. 1989. She's old. Yeah, she's an oldie but goodie. Karen at the beach is out. Waiting on joy. All righty then. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'll tell you what. 
I'll tell you what. Okay. All right. Not in, Joy. Joy says not in. Sorry. I'm All right. In. Are you sure, Joy? Nikki's in for 65. I can sweeten the pot. But wait, there might be more. You guys want me to stop or you want me to sweeten the pot? Mama G asked Donna to sell me an amazing album lot. I will, Connie. Nancy's going to come in for 70. Donna, can you sell Robert Johnson an amazing, epic lot of albums, please? That's what she wants to hear. All right, you get this one, too. Yep. Ooh. Oh. oh, she's pretty. Isn't she beautiful? Yes. She's very beautiful. So you get her and her and her. My ears, my ears. <laughs> Janine, sorry. It's not me, Janine. I didn't do it. I have no idea what you're talking about, Janine. I don't know if she's at the at the beeping noise or me going. <laughs> she's beautiful all right connie johnson wants a mystery box of records how much connie johnson she'll make it to order robert how much you want to spend whose dress does this remind me of i have no idea i have no idea the social right, we're at 75 we're at 80 what do I have to do to get it to a hundred? Let me go shopping. Hold on. I'll be right back. <laughs> Kyle's like, Janine, you're. <laughs> I'll be right back. Let me go shopping. All right. Hold on. I know I, I know I have another Barbie here somewhere. Oh, Barbie. Where are you? Oh, it's a dynasty TV show dress. Oh, Karen knows. Oh, all right. I know I have one more Barbie. I know I do. I know I do. I know I do. I know I do. I got her. I got her. I got her. I got her. Okay, here she comes. Sounds like she's coming with a bunch of other stuff. <laughs> she's going to be taken out of her box. No! Oh, my God. Put that away. Are you kidding me? Mama, Donna, Mama, take, Mama, pull that right now. Pull that right now. That's not included in the slot. 100% not included. <sighs> Mama G, you said you didn't want it. Shut up. <laughs> hold on. Hold on. Hold on. People make I've me got my finger ready just to get the whole lot. <laughs> okay, hold on. Now you're going to make me go into the garage. Hold on. I got one more I'm going to show. Hold on. Hold you can sell it. It's fine. Oh, you're welcome, Mrs. Anonymous. And I promise if I can do another one, I absolutely will. All right, so Connie wants to spend a hundred bucks. <laughs> Janine, I'll send you more bagels, honey. <laughs> Janine, you gotta tell me what you want. You're she not fair. To get boxes. You buy things and donate them to shelters. You don't buy things for yourself. Okay. How about this one? Cool. All right. And Connie Johnson wants a hundred dollar mystery lot of records. All right, sweetheart. You got it. I'll make it special for you. How about that one? So you get that one. You get this Nancy one. at 80. You get this one. 
you get this one and you get all of these. Now will you go to a hundred? Now can we get a Benji? If not, it's okay. Don't worry. Don't worry. Okay. Let's sell it. All right. We're going to sell it to Nancy. No other interest. Making me run all over the place. Ah. <laughs> okay. Let's sell it. Let's sell it. Let's sell it. Going once to Nancy. So it's the four Barbies and the bucket. The bucket o Barbies. For $80 to Nancy. My granddaughter will love them. And you'll get oh, your so Benji because I'll pay you. I'll pay you 20 for Ariel. So you'll get your Benji. Oh no. No, you won't. Okay, <clears throat> lot number 15 is uh, Connie Johnson. Connie Johnson wants another lot of awesome rock and roll. Connie, you want rock and roll or you want, I think I might have um, some like rap stuff too. I'm not sure. I'll have to look. Or you like rock and roll. Happy dance. Happy dance for me. Thank you. Thank you, Nancy. Rock and roll. You and I can be chopped liver together. Kyle, Janine, why do you guys feel like you're chopped liver? Devil rock. I don't know what devil rock is. All right. I'll surprise her. Unless she writes something different in the chat. Are you on mute? No. Oh. No. Thank you, guys. Guys, thanks. Awesome night. Thank you so much for coming in. We appreciate it. Don't forget we're back on tomorrow. Donna's going to do a volleyball in lieu of coffee in the morning. Beach volleyball with the girls. Well, it's just actually Bo's playing, right? Just Bo is playing. Okay. So Bo, what do you think? 9.30? Um, we have to be there at 8.30. So, yeah, I'll probably start about 9.30. So probably about 9.30 on Donna's channel. And then we're back on Donna's channel sometime tomorrow. Six, seven, eight. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. see. We'll play it by ear, too. We'll see. We'll see. Usually beach volleyball is like three, four hours. So I'll be getting home like around one ish or something. And I don't know. I don't know what it is about the beach and the salt air, but it wipes me out. Oh, it does everybody. Yeah. Doesn't it? Yeah. I mean, I don't know if I just like, all right. All right. You guys will, oh, for those of you, um, Oh, uh, Anthony says, T, your scarf looks beautiful. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Connie thanks. Johnson said, rock and roll. Rock and roll it is, baby. Good night, guys. Appreciate you guys all. Thank you so much for coming in. Go over and tell Gary and the Treasure Hustlers, T, Donna, and Mama G sent you over. Uh, Mama G dropped the link in there, and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks, Richard. You're right. I should not forget the sunscreen. I haven't been in the sun in a long time. All right. Bye, you guys. Bye, guys. Bye. Thank you.